The day is live stream date. And the work on the power plant continues. All right, who's first today? It's Lena. Hey, Cole Sphere. YouTube is rocking and rolling. <sighs> I did not feel so good. I ate way too much dinner. I, uh, we made like homemade, like, uh, traditional, like legit lasagna. Oh my gosh. I ate way too much. And then we have a lemon tree in our backyard and there's a bunch of ripe lemons. And so we made lemon bars again. I just, I, I ate way too much. Ugh, gotta get used to having the smaller stomach. So, you know, if I go quiet randomly throughout this stream, you know, well, I'll let your imagination fill in the rest. All right, Twitch is up and running. <laughs> it's not that bad, but I definitely did eat too much food. All right, so I'm excited. I didn't want to stop last night, but of course we had to stop because I was tired. So we're going to jump right in. While this loads, we're going to talk a little bit about what we're building. So just very, very quickly, uh, I'm, I'm just gonna do a quick overview here. If you want a more in-depth in, uh, in overview on what I'm working on, I just made a video. It's only uh, about a week or, or so old. Uh, it's titled, That's No Moon. It's 17 minutes long, and it'll tell you all about the power plant that we're building. But this is the basic breakdown of what we're trying to do. It's 10,500 um, packaged oil per minute is gonna be entering the, the system along with 31,200 packaged water per minute. And then uh, that is right here and right here, All right? And then out of this, we're gonna get 15,000 per minute fuel, almost 10,000 per minute plastic, 2,700 per minute rubber, and 5,700 per minute petroleum coke. So that's that's really what the plan is here. And we're trying to get the major parts of this in place. Now, I do have a blueprint that kind of combines four pieces of this puzzle, okay? It, it basically combines these four jobs in one blueprint. Okay, it unpackages the oil, okay? Then it turns that oil into heavy oil residue. And then that combines with the packaged water in the diluted packaged fuel recipe to make packaged fuel. And then that fuel gets unpackaged and sent out. Okay, well, actually all, all three of these are, are fuel. It gets sent out. All right, and so we need 404 of these. All right, and that's kind of what we've been working on this whole time. Um, now, a piece of this 
Actually, I think a little bit of the unpackaging oil too. Yeah, yeah. Another another blueprint, I'm gonna change colors here, is gonna be this right here. Okay, so it's gonna unpackage the oil, some of it, right? Not all of it gets used for the fuel. Some of it gets used, some of this heavy oil residue gets used to make petroleum coke. Not many, just 47 and a half refineries worth. Okay, but we will need some, okay? And I don't know exactly what this number is yet because I haven't designed this. Uh, I have not designed this blueprint yet, but we will get this set up so that we can make our petroleum coke. And that's probably gonna go in the nose of the superstar destroyer. Okay, and then let's do another color here. How about yellow? And then we're gonna have this sucker right here. And he's gonna be a bit of a beast. All right. Um, and we may split him actually into two pieces. I'm not, and that actually, yeah, we're gonna split him into two pieces. He's gonna be this piece and then this piece. Okay, two separate blueprints that'll work together. All right, that's gonna go in the back, in like that back square of the Super Star Destroyer, okay? So this is our three major components that are gonna make our, do our three different jobs, okay? We're gonna make the fuel with the main piece that we're working on today. Then we're gonna make the petroleum coke in the, in the nose and then we're gonna make rubber and plastic with some of the fuel and some of the water and the polymer resin. All right? So that's the general plan. And here is where we left off. Now, what I've been trying to do is fit those 404 blueprints into the belly of this beast. Okay, so this 404 blueprints are gonna go in, in into this middle area. Up there, you can see the end of it, kind of where the trains start. Okay, and I, of course, kind of split it in half. All right, and then, you know, the idea being, then we'll double it. Um, and we've got several blueprints that work together. Okay, an input bus, an output bus, and then this guy and then there's multiple versions of this guy there's the one that will work as a first floor there's one up there that is a second floor and then there's one over here that is a first floor without a second floor so basically it doesn't have these supports okay um, and then this back area is where we're gonna be making the plastic and the rubber. At least I think there should be enough room. Um, and then we had to extend this section out. It's one of the last things we did. If you look, we we moved this wall back. Okay, and if we, if we look over here, one of the first things we're gonna do tonight is we're going to move this wall back just like we did this one um actually we're probably not going to do that actually yeah sorry we're not going to do that until we're building the f these factories inside so that i know exactly where to move it back but but yeah you can tell i think i think it looks good actually it looks perfectly fine moved back right i mean He's, he's a little fat, but it looks good. I think it looks good. Hey, Summer Child. Thanks. Um, and then we may have to make this box a little bigger. You know, we'll see when we get to those yellow circles that I had. 
um but this is this is it and we just gotta lay this down now i did realize that uh i have a mistake in one of my blueprints luckily it's the one blueprint that we've built the least okay so it's the output blueprint that goes in the center so we're gonna uh of each of of each double row and so we're gonna it's this guy right here let me let me explain to you what the issue is now three that this output bus handles three separate items okay and it handles them from both sides okay we have i don't have any copper sheets uh, i'm gonna go down and do a run here first thing but we have the output into the fuel line okay and then we've also got the resin now the resin i'm planning on dealing with at the ass end here so and and which way is it flowing okay it's flowing that way that's great but here's the problem look at this one this is empty canisters and look how i have them flowing towards the ass end we don't want them over there we need them where they came from back going back to this direction back to the trains so what i'm gonna do is we have to reverse the flow of the this middle line because this is empty canisters and they have to go that in that direction um and then i was i would figured while i was doing this i was gonna make build out the fuel bus because we're gonna we're gonna need a bunch of fuel lines so i don't know i i don't know exactly how i'm gonna do that yet i'm gonna decide but yeah maybe we just build a bunch of these that's probably what we'll do and then we'll delete whatever we whatever we don't need but then it'll be easier to delete what we don't need than build these out of thin air where we do need them does that make sense so we're gonna we're gonna fix up this little this little guy first and there's two versions of him there's a first floor version and then there's a second floor version which i tested over here right here here's the second floor version so we got to fix them both up all right and don't mind me i'm just struggling with the fact that i uh over eight all right so let me answer your question summer summer child um well we're using uh we, we are using the uh, diluted packaged fuel right and so that brings in packaged water and then we're gonna and then we directly unpackage the the packaged fuel into fuel All right and then we're training up the packaged oil and packaged water uh but eventually i my goal is to drone it all over but for now we're, we're gonna train it up because we don't have the power to drone it um but yes, we are using the package diluted fuel recipe, so we don't have to pre-unpackage the water. All right. Okay. Let's make our first uh, run to pick up some goodies. Oh, man. The problem was, as I was a little bit rushed, dinner was a little late, and so I ate too fast as well. And then I like stood up to come in here and I was like, oh my God, I ate too much. I didn't realize how much I had overeaten until I stood up. And then, uh, and then it was time to live stream. So I'm struggling a little. <laughs> yeah, the pipe work. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna limit that. Uh, 
The pipework will not be spaghetti, Lena. Why would you say something so hurtful? I don't I don't I don't know why you would say something so hurtful. But no, we're gonna um Oh, I need a, a bunch of that. We're gonna I'm gonna do what I can to to limit that. And uh, Lena doesn't know what she's talking about. She's just she's being purposefully mean. Lasagna pipes. I had lasagna. Oh, it was so good. All right for dinner. It's way too good. I'm suffering from how good it was. All right, we're about we're about full here. What else do we got? Um All right, let's go. Ramen. Organized spaghetti. No, they're going to be in straight lines. I am. I, every last drop of oil. So I already have 1,200 working right here. And the remaining 10,500 is what we're dealing with. So yeah, and we've already got all the oil sitting in there. It's done. That took like two months. It's all sitting in there, ready to be turned on. Good times. Uh, okay. Let's deal with some of this doing uh, let's turn on oh wow green screen starting right away that was a bad one but I'm still alive so that's good right out the gate starting with that stupid green screen I'll fix it one day guys one day Uh, what am I doing? Being distracted. Here we go. Uh, we need a bunch of output manifolds. Let's take 20. Make sure we got everything we need. Yeah, I know. You freaking trolls. Um... Go. Okay, now let's build this out in the sunshine. I'm uh, not doing one long manifold, are you? No, look at look at all these rows. Uh, I mean, I'm doing multiple long manifolds. <laughs> You'll see. Uh, but we got to fix up. We got to fix up this blueprint because there's th uh, something going the wrong way and I thought of it like this afternoon and realized that if I didn't fix it I would be hating life all right so what side's the front this is the front we want the our friend the resin to go forward but we want 
this guy to go backwards. Okay. All right, so we want a merger. We need him to go backwards. Like this. Simple enough. Okay. So that's good. Now, you see what I've built here for the extra bus lines for when these fill up? I need that. I need that for the fuel. Okay. I think I'm gonna get rid of this and I'm gonna do this Um, let's see It'd be 10. Yeah, this should be enough. This should be enough because You're getting 60 fuel per minute out of each one And so that means it it, could, it should be able to handle 10 per Well either way we may have to build on some of those middle ones. Those middle ones are a little longer. Oh, it's kind of eating into our their work there, isn't it? Crap. Yeah, that's gonna look really crappy. So we're not gonna be able to do that. All right, let's think for a second. How we're gonna design this bus, do what I want to do. Probably have to go up two. Do one. Yeah, I think we could do this. Should I just leave those? I think I will. Just like I did with the ones for the belts. I didn't actually build the belts. That way I'll just build what I need and then I'll delete what I don't need. Oh my God, you said green screen again. 
you would give a solid suggestion no more than 10 per pipe group on the oil with a 5-5 five, five split. Well, they're getting 60 in. They're getting 60 per minute in and it hold, and they're going to hold 600. So it's going to get 10. Uh, because each each blueprint outputs 60 uh, 60 per minute. I have nightmares about spaghetti. No, it's not the spaghetti I have nightmares about. Right now, I'm going to have a nightmare about the, this lasagna. It was so good, I may die. As one that has used every last drop of oil from an area or coal, even right down to a T, I am very intrigued. Yeah, yeah, we'll see. Uh... I mean, the oil's ready to go. Uh, I will be turning this on in two phases. Um, I'm gonna build the whole thing, but I'm only gonna input the like the first 50% of the inputs. So, uh, and so we won't be using it all just yet. Uh, Cause I need to build a battery factory. Basically, I'm gonna turn on half the power get half of it running and then go build the battery factory and then once I have batteries running I will build and turn on the other half uh, and this is where all the fuel gens are gonna go on the top of the the star destroyer here so it's like 1300 fuel gens I think so yeah uh, all right so this is the first one I uh, feel good and then whatever we don't need I'll I'll delete them but that should be more than enough pipe work, pipe work for us. All right. All right, now I just got to do the flying version. The flying eye. Oh, I love the flying eye. Uh, output main first floor. Now my fault, spaghetti and is that sushi? <laughs> I think that's sushi and lasagna are his favorite belt and pipe work. Right, right. All right, let's get rid of this. Uh, and then we're switching around our friend. I mean, uh, we could do this easier than I did before. Can we do a merger? And where's the front? That's the front. So it needs to go the opposite. That. And then, well, I guess I will still need the ground though, huh? Yeah, so I get the post on. All right, fine. Right in the middle, right? Uh, I should have built this in the middle so I don't screw it up. Rid of this. Merger going backwards, right? Yep, that's what we want. Cool. Um, now we're going to build out. Yeah. 
this. Uh, let me make sure I'm building this the same as I built the other one. Uh, two on each side. All right. Okay. And then I don't know how many of those I'll need exactly, but they're there. So I don't have to do this like times 150, right? And then I'll just delete whatever I don't need and it'll be way, way, way faster. All right. this all right so let's see how she works do the flying one first Oh, it's doing this stupid bug. Really irritates me. But there we go. Just delete the blueprint designer and it goes away. All right, let's try that again. Perfect. There we go. That's how they'll hook up. Obviously, when I actually go to build these, I'll change my default pipe color watch, but. That is gonna be how they'll hook up. And then when these fill up, I'll load them onto these here. And then when those belts fill up, I'll load them onto here. And then when this pipe fills up, I'll load them into there. Does that make sense? Subscriber meetup party, tea spaghetti lasagna, sushi provided. No, if we're having a party, I'm gonna make barbecue. I don't, I don't care about the memes. We're having barbecue. Uh, all right, uh, let's do the other middle one here. Let's make sure he works. Oh, and then we're getting rid of all this. Don't need. I was putting in flooring, right? And then I realized that my blueprints have their own flooring. So uh, let's save the resources and perhaps objects. Is clipping included or extra? You know what? It 
hurts my feelings. Hold on. Someone is calling. Who? My brother. I'm literally, I, I, like, dude. He knows I'm live streaming. What a turd. All right, what are we doing? Getting distracted is what we're doing. Um, all right, so let's let's pop in two of these. Let's see. Let's make sure they line up, shall we? One. Oh, I forgot to make sure that it was facing the right way, because this one's not. Yeah, it's wrong actually. All right, so this is how this will look. Right, and then we'll come in here and we'll do some attachy attachy. And then we'll attach here. And then we'll attach there. Uh oh, is there uh, is there an error? Uh, did I make an error? That's a splitter. Dang it! Needs to be a merger. I did make an error. All right, this is why we're testing. This is why we're here, Meg. Uh, crap. All right, let's get rid of them. Uh, did I make that error here? That's a merger. That's a merger. Okay. Uh, I just did it on the, the first floor. My bad, Mario. My bad. It's you. But we should just be able to very nicely control replace. Yep. Looks good. Quick fix. That would have sucked. That's why we test it before we build 500 of them. I mean, I still may make mistakes, but you know, we can, we can at least try. Seems to be working better. good all 
All right, so it'll look something like this, and then we'll pop this on. Now, and then we'll change the numbers. Okay. Yeah, I like this. Uh, I I am in a closed loop. It would be insane for me to do this and make. Uh, you have to do a closed loop. You you absolutely have to do a closed loop with packagers. You can't do it any other way. The amount of plastic that you would need to real time make enough canisters for 10,500 packaged oil and 32,000 uh, packaged water per minute. You, I mean, you would need, you know, almost 45,000 packaged, uh, 45,000 canister, empty canisters per minute. That'd be insane. It would use up all your plastic. <laughs> so no, it's absolutely going to be a closed loop. It can't be any other way. Um, all right, that's fixed. So what do we get to do next? Um, let's, let's make sure I didn't, uh, build any other middles like this bad boy. Let's, let's delete these. There's a couple here and there that I kind of put in as placeholders. How's my inventory? We got a little bit more room. Uh, my goal is tonight to get in all of the blueprints. Uh, we won't really be able to connect them uh, tonight. I, I think that's probably too too big of an ask. But uh, to get in all of these blueprints and then and maybe count them. Uh, maybe label them if if we can that's gonna be really tedious, but it's gonna be really important And then and then we've got to move that wall back just like we moved last night uh, But those are the big those are the big items uh, 29 concurrent viewers welcome guys. Uh, hold on. I've got a little Browser issue. There we go. We're all hooked up uh, What kind of barbecue would you be preparing for the subs Ken? Uh, so so if I did that I would absolutely be doing like Texas barbecue like slow cooked uh brisket basically uh brisket and other and other goodies other Texas goodies I really like actually chicken thighs smoked chicken thighs I think we got all the, oh here's one here's a row I didn't get uh but brisket's the main course the the star of the show Okay, so what should we do first? Do we do want to work outside in? Yeah, let's work. Let's work outside in. Okay. Start there and let's work our way in. Okay. So we're bringing packaged product up, unpacking and then bringing empty containers down. Yes, we are. That's why we have two train stations. So the packaged product comes up and will be loaded into or unloaded. See, empty can, uh, oh, well, reverse actually, sorry. Uh, it comes up this way. It's unloaded. Now let me fly over here just so we can see the, uh, the name. Yeah, water bottle unload C, Sky Superstar Destroyer. Water bottle unload A, Sky Superstar Destroyer. And then uh, packaged oil unload Sky Superstar Destroyer. Uh, and then the trains will, after they unload their goods, they'll run over here and they will load up the empty canisters. Only seem to catch the live streams when formula one is in southern hemisphere watch all the vods well welcome rhino I, i've seen you around you catch it you catch it often um uh okay so 
yeah, let's let's make sure we have what we need in our inventory. What are we gonna build? Let's try to build like like maybe twenty of those. Stop it. And then maybe like twenty of those. And then 20 of these. Can I afford this much goodies? We have a lot of it already. Um, but we are pretty full. What do we have too much of? We have too much cable. Uh, and we have way too much concrete. So if we ditch some cable and concrete, we should be able to load up enough to build that. Um... So yeah, uh, no news on who actually won the weight loss contest that I was doing. Uh, just quick update if you missed last night. I've been in a, um, uh, yeah, Summer Child, I have uh, 250,000 empty canisters already built and sitting, waiting to be plugged in. I think 250,000, some, something like that. I don't know. It might be enough. Hmm. Uh, but yeah, so the weight loss contest is um, over. Uh, it was it was three. It was ninety days, but I missed the first eight days. I lost uh, eighty nine point two pounds, and uh, I was announced as taking second place because. I lost the second most raw amount of weight, but the rules may have said percentage. <laughs> and that's kind of what we thought. And then I was, uh, I thought as a percentage basis, I took fifth or sixth, which is, and there's only prizes for the top three. So it really matters to me. <laughs> it matters what, how, because if you count it in one way, you know, I, uh, I'm gonna not win. So, you know, it matters. Uh, let's get rid of all of that concrete. We still have plenty of concrete. Yeah, we still have plenty of concrete. Let's pick up these. Let's drop off those. And we need, oh, uh, we have some. Uh, yeah, the the seating happens where they get packaged, right? So the oil seating, the oil seated uh, empties are in here, and then the water seated empties empties are way over there because uh, the packaged water is actually happening in this factory and it's going to get trained into the bottom and then transferred up and then either droned over or sky trained over but then the, all the oil on the map gets is piped to the bottom of this and then it gets packaged in the center and then so so that's that's way, where those empty canisters are are seated um we're almost done here i just need uh where's the rest of my Sorry, this is not the most efficient way to do this. I guess I'm out, which is really freaking horrifying. So these are temporary. Um, uh, encased industrial, we're out of encased industrial. Which sucks and we may have to go to the starter base to get it. Um, but let's do a quick, uh, Summer Child is, uh, new and has joined us and, and I've found usually that when one person's new and they're asking questions that usually there's other people that are new and they would like the answer to the questions, but they don't have the guts to, uh, ask them themselves. And so I, uh, you know, this is for everybody who may not know. Uh, so, so yeah, this is the SkyTrain setup 
for the oil and the water coming in it's all ready to rock and roll um and then uh just like the imperial senate building in star wars these are our oil packagers uh the oil is sitting in here ready to go okay it's all it needs is the empty canisters this is on okay it's just it's just not working because we haven't fed it empty canisters okay these are ready to go uh we also have uh representative binks here uh representative binks the third don't ask about one and two uh and then the packaged uh oil or the empty packagers like i say uh this is where the water is gonna come up it's like a waterfall except you know in reverse uh here's a bunch of the canisters for the oil and then there's an equal amount on the opposite side right and then um and these will just feed in all i have to do is connect that and it starts okay um and there's something uh, there's a similar setup for the water packagers on the other side so, so there you go and then uh down here is the water bottle unloading and empty canister reloading Oops, sorry uh, and then we have a giant train spiral, which is just egregiously too large. Uh, and I love it. All right, don't at me, bro. Uh, here's our oil spiral. These are all filled with oil and they all have enough head lift to make it into the oil uh, packagers. All right. And uh, yeah. And then this is my item delivery system. uh absolutely amazing build uh thanks summer i appreciate that all right it'd be nice though if i kept if i didn't forget parts okay good we have we have some but let's go and steal let's do it and then th this is the train lines my blueprinted train lines that can change elevation as well as curve um nice gentle curves and split um, and all sorts of fun stuff. They can actually incline and curve at the same time. That was really difficult. Uh, but you know, here's a split. This is one of my first curves. So it's using an old system. It's a little bit like little bit curve straight, little bit curve straight. I, I did a better job after, uh, after that section. But anyway, yeah, here's our item delivery system. This is the starter base. Uh, we are headed up here into the here's uh this is the starter base this is making everything that's supplying our um, our construction efforts up to radio control units I think so these are vertical buses I got this idea from Stin Archie um, and then uh, I kind of went crazy with it um, we want more what do we want uh, where's our encased industrial, bro? Well, we don't have a lot. Um, and we're actually using a decent amount of that. Uh, let's do a quick little overclock. Look how slow that's going. We need some more encased industrial. So it's over here somewhere if I remember. There's some sushi belt. There we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right, we got plenty of concrete, plenty of steel pipe. Oh no, it's underclocked. That's that. That's not good. No wonder we don't have very much. The thing is, is I didn't use any for a long, long time, and we were short on concrete. Well, that's underclocked too. Uh, I'll leave that underclocked actually. Um, let's go ahead. What did I do? I just doubled it, right? Is there any more coming into that line? Yeah, what's this? Same thing? Oh yeah, all these were all these were fit, halved. But idiot did that. Somebody got onto my save and, and made a stupid choice. It wasn't me at all. I, I did that when I was low on concrete. To save concrete, but we don't need that problem. Now we need our 
encased industrial production up. All right, that's good. Let's get back to work. And there is the Super Star Destroyer. Oh, it looks so good from a distance. Like, it looks really freaking good. And, like, it doesn't even have the... Sort of the, the super structure building stuff that we're going to use uh, fuel gens to reproduce yet. Uh, but then the eventual goal is that we get rid of the Skytrain completely and uh, everything gets droned over. Everything. So, I don't know. I don't know if, if my computer can handle that, but we're going to try. Uh... The spiral looks nice. Might have to borrow the idea for my water for my nuclear plant. Yeah, I didn't um I didn't come up with that spiral design. I stole that from a it's a YouTube video. There's a YouTube video that breaks down how you do that. Uh I wish I was that smart. I so I mean look, I I know my strengths. It's not like a false modesty thing. Okay, I know what I'm good at, I know what I'm not good at. Uh let's see. Can we can we fill up or oh we got fat we got fat uh, one of the things that I'm good at we still we have too much iron plate come on come on we need an empty spot there we go one of the things that I am good at is adapting other people's really smart ideas <laughs> okay I, i'm not super good at like coming up with the smart ideas necessarily but i i i'm pretty good at adapting them uh con we still have too much concrete all right all right, let's build some stuff, shall we? We're gonna start from the outside back corner and we're gonna work our way towards the middle. And let's turn on the light. It was triples in the engine room. Oh, that's okay. All science fiction references are welcome. No judgment here. All right, let's let's finish this last little little baby row that we have started here. Um, it is going to be a total pain in the ass to number these. I'm sorry. Uh, I don't know if we're going to get to it tonight. I hope so. We may actually have be forced to get to it tonight because if I run out of materials, we may have to do other things while we wait for those materials to, to be rebuilt. Um, and, and numbering these is probably going to be something we have to do and it's going to suck, but there's no, there's no way around it. it it's going to suck, but it's, I think it's important. So we'll definitely have like story time or something. Maybe I'll talk about. I don't know. We'll come up with something for me to talk about. Um, you know what I need to do? I need to build these the other direction so I can be sure that I know what is front. So I have to start these over here and build in this direction. I think Pee Wee has sworn off being being a troll. All right, so what I'm looking for here is, do you see that little square? It's really hard to see. Well, it's not that hard to see. That square right there, that is the, the stupid indicator that I came up with so that I know which way is the front. And so that's why I have to build this direction so that I'm sure that, and then I'm just looking at the front of the blueprint next to it. I could also look at the front of the back one but the front of the one next to it seems to work a little better. And we are not doing hookups 
until I have everything numbered and I know that everything is gonna fit because the hookups are gonna be a real pain in the ass. And right now, things can be deleted and moved really quickly because of blueprints and blueprint deletion. Um, but once we do hookups, that's it. We're not, we're not moving, right? So we gotta be, I want everything accounted for. Probably everything in the factory accounted for before we do these, these hookups, okay? All right, um, nice. Let's finish off this row. I uh, first got the idea of using Max Oil from Decoba and his modular diluted fuel. So that's interesting. That's not somebody that I have watched or even I don't think heard of. Uh, and I and I I'm not gonna say that I know and watch everybody, but I, I usually have a pretty good feel for. You know who's out there uh, but uh, interesting I like it I don't I'm not gonna say that I'll go check him out because I don't have any time in my life and I probably won't but uh, that's cool that there's somebody that I haven't heard of um, all right so that that's done basically let's get these guys in Um, Max Oil for me came with, the idea for me came with playing with, um, satisfactorytools.com. Where's my, where's the correct window? I, I think I have too many windows. Right here. So playing with this, uh, made me want to do Max Oil. Plus, you know, to be honest with you, I think... I think YouTube, you know, content creators, like for Satisfactory, you know, we got a, ooh, piece of candy. Uh, we, we, we've got to uh, do something, you know, do something crazy. You know, we need a shtick. So I've got Star Wars, I've got Mega Factories, I've got all these drones. I have too many sticks. Maybe, maybe I picked too many sticks. Too many babas. Uh, let's switch and build these. I'm breaking the game, guys. Look at that. Oh my God, that looks so amazing. That was awesome. And all those pipes come in there. Oh, that was really cool. All right. Um, I did run out of parts though. So let's, let's reload. Um, how many more do I need ish? Like one, two, three, four, five, ten, twelve for that one. And then kind of a lot more for for these so maybe 20 again for now twenty and then an, uh, another 20 here for now at least 
I've always thought about trying a satisfactory stream on YouTube. Yeah, I, um, yeah, I mean, you know, I'm not going to say don't do it, but you know, don't do it because you'll steal viewers from me. No, I'm just kidding. It's all, it's all, it's all good. Uh, you have to really, um, so I have to be really careful. Get a couple extra of these. Um, I really enjoy this. Uh, and I, if I don't do it, I, I really do start to miss it. You know, um, because this is, this is the only gaming that I do. I don't, I don't do any other gaming. I, I just don't, uh, I don't have a lot of time and, uh, the editing is just insane amount of time that it takes. That's why I'm making fewer and fewer edited videos, you know, kind of, unfortunately, I wish I could do more because they pay really well. I, I just don't have, I don't have a lot of time. The live streams don't really make me a lot. I mean, over time they add up, uh, but the edited videos are kind of where the where the YouTube really gets the money to me you know I do have a uh, I have some plans for some oh, what do we need don't need that I hope that we're not like dangerously low on wire and quick wire because that would suck do I not have any stashes of wire and I have to go again, you guys? All right, I'm just gonna literally go and get all of the wire and quick wire we own. Ugh. Some dummy designed the blueprints to be extremely expensive. Cause he wanted lights and he wanted Freaking catwalks. Yeah, waiting for 1.0. Yeah, so for me, kind of my plan. So, well, I've always wanted. So, this is my second YouTube channel. And I wanted to do gaming. And my first YouTube channel has a higher chance of making me money that can replace my income than this one does, I think. Although this one can too. Um, the other one has a wider audience, but it, it's a much slower, uh, growth and, um, it takes me longer to make videos for that channel. And so I wanted to start this channel to kind of give myself some more experience in YouTube where I could push content out, content out more regularly. And so, um, that's one reason I started it. Another one is, is that I've always wanted to do a gaming channel. I mean, I mean, we all do kind of, like not everybody, but a lot of people do. Hey, Mikey on Twitch. Right. And so, you know, I wanted to do that, put the wires in those when I get back and then let's empty all my shit out into these. All right. All right, let's go steal all the quick wire and wire. Um, and so, and the other thing is, is that I really wanted to do the Super Star Destroyer, but I thought to myself, like, I'm not gonna, I don't wanna do this and show it to like my wife, like my kid and like my brother. Like if I'm gonna do this, and put in this amount of work, like I want to do some, like I want to show it to as many people as possible, you know? And, you know, and then I thought, you know, I, I think that a lot of people want to see that. Right. And so that was kind of like, okay, well, yeah, that means I can, maybe I can actually, you know, make this, make a channel work. Ooh, yeesh. Uh, let's turn on wire. 
delivery as well as quick wire delivery. Fill those back up. Um, and then, and then of course the other one too was, yeah, 1.0, you know, I, at the time, I mean, I started almost a year ago, exactly this, this playthrough, it's about a year old, you know, I didn't know, I thought I was thinking maybe we'd get an update nine. I started this playthrough the night up, uh, update eight hit experimental. I waited until update eight hit experimental. And that was my first live stream. If you go to VOD one and watch it that is update eight experimentals launch night i um, mean it was super buggy still so you know it there was yeah there was issues oh yeah we're full of wire now boys get out of here so those it was really choppy plus i didn't have my settings really dialed in i mean i still don't i still get green screen um, but my thought was that, you know, I would build an audience during update eight and what I thought was maybe update nine, right? And then when 1.0 comes out, I can launch a new playthrough on 1.0 and already have an audience, right? Instead of launching with zero for a new playthrough, you know, I started as a way to push past the anxiety of hearing and, and being heard on recordings. Yeah. Yeah, I had an advantage there. I, um, so I, uh, I sang in high school and college choirs for like 10, 12 years between high school and college and then some, some after college stuff. Uh, so sort of the performing, uh, part, uh, you know, doesn't bother me. And sort of the voice control part, man, I need another one. I built I built too much I grabbed too much too much wire it's gonna be the combined yeah all right well, I mean we need some there we go that that'll that'll that should do us all right and then all right nice good 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 um steel pipe Tell me I have steel pipe in here. Cannot believe how much some of the stuff I'm not I don't realize how much I'm using. If I have to go back for steel pipe, I'm gonna rage. Well, at least it's story time. I mean, we have to move all this stuff and I'm moving as much as I can. Uh, yeah, Eye in the Sky, I never knew you had another channel. Now I'm curious about its contest. Is it linked somewhere in this channel's info? Kind of, kind of Eye in the Sky. So if you look and see what I have on my store, that is my, it's really my wife's channel. It's mine and my wife's channel. Um, she, she paints, um, uh, oil painting landscapes. And so the store from this, for this channel, I, I linked to, uh, her, I mean, it's ours, right? But it's her online store. So we have a Shopify channel, all that good stuff. Let's go ahead and steal all of these while we're here. And then let's go drain, go drain the pipes. No pun, no, no pun intended. Uh, update put me on a billboard and sign frenzy. Oh yeah. I've put way too many signs in the safe. I mean, look at my, dude, look at the, look at how many signs I have for my, in my train blueprint. Like they're all over the walls. There's a bunch here. There's a bunch uh, in the middle here. There's. Yeah, see right here, lining, lining the, uh, all this stuff. Yeah, I, I, 
I do way too much. Oh, I have some really cool ones down here. I have some cool ones in here. This was one of the first ones I did with billboard with um, billboards and lights down in the basement of my item uh, thing because I didn't really know what I was doing yet. So, but that turned out really cool, I think. Uh, and then the subfloor down here, we have a lot of lights, a lot of billboards and stuff going. Uh, I really like how these ceiling lights turned out because these large ones fit exactly into sort of a two foundation setup. So it almost looks like an office light. It's a lot softer light than like this thing, you know? And then I put these lights in and I, and I double sided them so that it, it would light up, you know, our main bus here. You know, and then I have all this stuff up here. Um, yeah, sorry, this has kind of turned into a little bit of a tour, guys. But I haven't done one of these in a few weeks at least, so. And then down here is the setup for the, um, this is version one of my remote item delivery system. Um, I have a video on that, but it's like 10 times smaller than this now. Like this was way too big. I came up with a better solution. So, but basically each one of these handles a, uh, basically using the remote switch, the prior to power switch, I switch on and off power to this awesome sink. And that awesome sink um, will eat, there's, there's iron ore in here. And then if it's turned on, like if I switch this on, right, it, it allows the iron ore to pass. And then it sends out the item, in this case, modular frames out there. And that gets delivered to my train station and the train station takes it to wherever I want. Right now that's over by the Super Star Destroyer. And then when I have, when I've had enough, then it, it shuts off, right? And it blocks that. Yeah, see that's full. That's ready to send uh, modular frames. But anyway, I, I came up with a much better space saving solution than this. This was just version one. Uh, I have two videos out on that system. So, um, and it's a lot better than this. This was so huge. This took up so much space. Um, and now I have one that includes drones as well. So anyway. Um, what, what did we come here for? Sorry, I got distracted showing off my My fun stuff. What are we? Oh, we're here for pipes. Are we, do, are we full? We're full Give me those pipes and just give me those two. All right No more pipes And then this is my vertical bus which I showed you last time and then I'm only running 1200 oil per minute right now two mark two uh, pipes all the other oil is going to be used in the the ship. Uh Yeah, you thought I could sing? Yeah, I can. Oh, sorry, that was your cat walking across the keyboard, Mikey. That's funny. Mikey's spamming Twitch and blaming his cat. Love those still still can't get up with a train support system that you can get on board with no pun intended <laughs> You can't get on board the train system. Well, you know Start with a ticket go from there. All right, let's Man, this is my storage system over here is turning into a thing I mean we're gonna need a uh, please sir. I'd like another All right, let's get some of this And let's get some of this. All right. What do we got left? Ooh. We have too much of all clad aluminum sheets. And. 
and maybe steel pipe. Oh, we still have too much steel pipe. All right. No. Uh, we'll come back for that. Uh, we just need... Iron rods. I better have more iron rods here somewhere. Two. This is... This is gonna suck. We're gonna have to go back for iron rods here in not too long. I think. Yeah, I, I don't think I have any more iron rods. Oh, there they are. There they are. Okay, good. Okay, good. All right, let's get to building. Finally. Squirrels are the real distraction. Nah, it's okay. We I needed a little time to build for the, for some of us, some of our items to rebuild. Um, and, you know, it's good to do a tour because I don't do one every day. Um, not, not, not even like a tour tour, but like... It's good to give people a chance to see stuff that maybe I haven't shown in a while. Like you. Like I said, you're just the one asking, but I'm sure that a lot of people are maybe watching this VOD and it's the first time they've seen a lot uh, this as a VOD. And that's probably the, uh, that may be the first time they've seen a lot of that stuff. So it's all good. I'm gonna stream for eight hours, okay? So I kind of need like a mental break sometimes before I before I move on, before I get back to work. All right. Uh, but yeah, I um. I can hold a tune. I'm not too bad. It used to be better. I'm out of practice. Uh, but I could, uh, you know, I, uh, I'm the guy that, uh, you know, you're out hanging out with or at the office party that has karaoke and everybody's like bad. And then that guy starts singing that is like you wouldn't expect it and he does really well. That's that's kind of me. I don't really I don't really talk about it, you know, very much or or anything like that. Um, talk about it to you guys because you guys are like my therapist. <laughs> All right, let's knock in some of these. So these are the this is the input bus. And then we are going to have to deal with this roof thing happening. I have to come up with something. Uh, but I, I traveled with, um, I went to Europe and China. In, in college with uh, an adult choir. Uh, we went to um, Munich, Prague, Budapest, and Vienna uh, in like 2004 or 2005. Uh, and then I, a couple years later, I went to China and sang on the, I sang, um, and we would sing things like the Hallelujah Chorus or Handel or I mean, I don't even remember. I, like, it was so long ago. I don't remember. But, you, you know, choir songs. <laughs> we sang choir songs. Y you, you, you'd know it if you heard it. And this is really going to be in the way. Uh, I'm going to delete these. We're going to build around our stuff later. We're, we'll, we'll, we'll find a way to make it that makes it look good later. I just need two more. Let's get rid of this. Uh, but yeah, I sang on the Great Wall of China. We did a concert on the Great Wall of China, which is really, really cool. Um, let's go ahead and get in all the first floor 
And then we'll worry about the second floor. Um, let's make sure also that this is all done up here. Right, yeah, the number crunching and um, also Linus trolling. I need a mental break from Linus trolling. And then there's the drop down. The drop off. Okay, and then we continue. Uh, now my sister, my sister can sing. I am okay. I'm good for a guy. Like, you know, uh, there's no chance. Like the only thing that I could make money at with my voice is basically this. You know, I, I can do this. Uh, I, I, I've, I've actually considered doing like voiceover work. Right, I, that's, that's how I can like make money with my voice, right? God, I absolutely love how those perfectly link up. Oh, it makes me so happy. Uh, my sister has a degree in voice. She has a bachelor of science in voice. Um, she's a music teacher. She's a voice teacher. Um, when she sings, she is good. I am, I am serviceable. I am okay. Uh, she's a, she's the kind of singer that, you know, you uh, can make people cry. I, my singing is, hey, that wasn't terrible. <laughs> that wasn't as bad as I expected. That's my singing. My singing is, hey, he, he, that wasn't as bad as I, I, I thought he would sound. That, <laughs> That's mine. My sister uh, will, you know, make you cry. No, that, that's the difference. There's, there's no emotions in mine, except for maybe relief that it's not as bad as it could have been. That's the only emotion. You'll feel from mine, but I actually, like I said, I actually considered um, maybe doing voiceover work. I think that would be really fun, um, but I don't have a lot of time, you know. And so I do my channel, and uh, it's 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 good enough. It's all I can do. All right, let's do twenty more, and then we need. Uh, let's just do. Let's keep doing our our twenties here. Why is this not working? There we go. Uh, and let's see if we can afford this. Uh, but yeah, if uh, so, my wife's channel, you need a thousand subscribers before you can or actually 500 before you can turn your shop on. Uh, oh, Mr. Gamer Tech 15, what does the outside of this look like? I will show you as soon as this autosave goes. We'll do a quick uh, on Twitch. We'll we'll check it out real quick. Um, what was I talking about? Uh, can't remember. I was talking about a voiceover. Oh, my channel. Oh, my wife's channel. I remember now. So, so like I said, she has a shop where we're trying to sell her art. Um, she's still building her inventory. She doesn't have a big inventory yet, um, but there's a lot of different products off of only three paintings. And so, you know, you can get different size poster boards or like, um, uh, like metal, you know, uh, you know, those aluminum, those steel prints, uh, and then canvas prints, um, different sizes, framed, unframed, all that good stuff. Um, but there's only three products right now, three different, many products, three different paintings. So we're trying to build that up. She's trying to build that up. She's painting right now, actually. Um, and, uh, and then my channel, this channel, Construction, it had, I obviously had unlocked the, the shop. 
you know the the marketplace and and her channel is not that that's not unlocked yet and so i didn't really have anything to sell and so i just figured that i would you know i would just sell i would attach uh her shop to my channel and i don't think anybody's bought anything and that's totally cool uh no 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 worries but it's there and uh you know i think as we build her sort of portfolio of work then uh we'll be able to push that more and that could actually be something in combined with this channel that i'm doing might i might you know be nice to one day maybe i i would like to replace my income you know i i would i do have that goal oh let's pick these up yeah okay uh i have a great job but it's it's not super fun for me i've i've, I've talked about that before uh let me get my I, I haven't forgot about you let me get this um i have rubber somewhere tell me i have I, I thought i brought a bunch of rubber up remember i made a bunch of rubber jokes i know that i brought rubber up where are you rubber did i use it all already this is like the worst that's okay we're gonna we're gonna go out These are like my temporary bins that I'm, um, using, uh, to drop, cause I'm going to pick these right back up. We're going to go grab all the rubber that we can. And then, um, I don't know what else we were short. Some iron rods maybe. Um, but let's, uh, I did promise, uh, Mr. Gamer Tech. Yes, yes. Uh, that we would uh, take a look at the Superstar Destroyer from the outside. So there you go. This is what it looks like. It's a beast. I love it. I'm really happy with it. It's my favorite ship. It's really the whole point of this. Yeah, <laughs> Gizmo. You, but your singing can make you cry as, uh, as your ears start to bleed. Yeah. Uh, Munich is only 300 kilometers away from me, but thanks to the nearest to the city you named and the capital of my state at least. So, so we sang Eye in the Sky. Are you familiar, familiar with, um, I'm going to say it really badly. I, I'm sorry. I'm a, I'm a dirty American. Uh, Autoboyrin. Like this, I got, oh my God, we don't have any rubber. That's bad. We need to turn the rubber on. Um, we're actually... Yeah, we're we're gonna turn we're gonna turn rubber on here. Uh, it's like a small town, Autoboyrin, and it's got uh, like an amazing uh, old school like cathedrally church in it. I sang at that. I that was some somewhere outside of Munich. I I was on a bus and I don't know where we went. <laughs> Oh, you want to find a choir that you could join and improve? Yeah, that'd be cool. Um, I'm, I'm so busy these days. Uh, I, I can't even think about doing that, but maybe when I retire. Uh, rubber, rubber, rubber. We're here for rubber. The problem is we're, we're burning through so many materials so fast. I'm spending more time going to get materials than I am. Now I'm going to raid the secret stash of rubber. Not that secret I just showed you guys, but um, I forgot how to get down to the secret floor. All right, where is the rubber? Uh, I need the rubber building. Where are you, rubber? Okay, you're not in that row. That looked like rubber, but it was steel. There we go. Secret stash. 
Rated. No more rubber for you. Uh, what else? Uh, iron rods. I don't think there's going to be any iron rods in the secret stash down here. Feel like iron rods are going to be back here. But I'll I'll just check. Apparently not. I'm pretty sure there isn't any. What the heck, bro? I've checked like... Oh, oh I forgot. There's another row over here. Here they are. <laughs> yeah, there's none in there. They're turned on. Oh. All right. All right, let's get out of here. We grabbed the rubber. Uh, let's just make sure there's no iron rods back here at the bank. I don't think there there might be. Oh yeah. Oh, give it to me, Neil. All right, let's get out of here. Oh, it's so pretty. Uh, gonna head out for a rest. Okay, thanks for stopping by, Summer Child. You can angle the signs to be easier to see them from the distance. Oh, the ones down at the uh, in the bottom floor that I was looking at. Nah, I never go down there. <sighs> Although I've been down there twice today, but I never go down there. Hmm. <laughs> Uh, that looks pretty cool. Just extremely big and would be one heck of a build. Yeah uh, The shell of this came together in just a couple of weeks It went together fast. I used blueprints to help build it faster But yeah All right, so we have the rubber Luke Use the rubber All right, let's do a couple of stashes of rubber here. Okay. And now I'm gonna, uh, oh, and then we need a stash of iron rods, but let's pick up some. Okay, boom, boom, boom. And we're gonna leave a box, aren't we? No box, perfect. Um, and then there we go. All right, we're reloaded, loaded for bear, unlimited rubber. Use the rubber. What if she's really hot? Use your best judgment. Well, I wonder if these connect as well. Do these connect as well? Oh, yes. Makes me so happy. I know I said I wouldn't start connecting these yet, but for some reason, just connecting these, uh, Make me make me just ridiculously happy. Um, okay. Where was I when I ran out of stuff? I think we've got all this built. Got this built. Um, all right, we're gonna need. Ooh, how are we gonna do this? think we just here let's make sure make ourselves a little bit of room
Oh, there's a mistake. All right. Uh, that's okay. We can fix it. So whenever I go up, eats one foundation horizontally, and I have to I have to adjust for that everywhere in that row that is using. In this case, it's just these guys, but I gotta delete these. And then it's gonna, I know it's gonna happen. I played this game before. And one more. That means I'm gonna have to kill these two. All right, and then I just got to build a spacer in here. Okay. Now, should go right on. It is not right on. Still not right on. All right, this is killing me. So we're gonna delete it and then we'll put it back. Better? I got better. Patterns, and we're going with this one. Okay. I think I had three. Can we still fit three? Ooh. That sucks. But I mean, this train station is hopefully temporary anyway. So, <laughs> it'll be all right. Okay. We'll deal with the rest of it later. Good enough for now. All right, nice. Uh, so I think these rows are all in now. Oh, we gotta we gotta put this in. We're already out of concrete. Oh, because I stashed some. Where did I stash it? Stash it here. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. We'll be doing a slim gym.
All right. Nice, nice, nice. So those rows are done. Uh, I think this is done all the way down. Did we get this middle all the way down? Nope, we didn't. Put in a couple of these, shall we? Unlimited! I, I get the reference now. <laughs> Instead of unlimited power. That's deep Bavaria. I know it went there with my dad one time because he always wanted to go there for his deceased grandma. I was in the church. Really beautiful. Yeah, yeah. I uh, I, I wanted to say that it was Bavaria, but I wasn't sure. Um, and I didn't want uh, better to, you know, keep your mouth shut and be thought a fool kind of a thing there. Um, with Bavaria there. Because I... I can't really remember very much uh, on details like that, you know, but it was, it was awesome. Uh, yeah, let's, let's build this beast out. All right, hopefully this will look really cool like the last time. <laughs> that was fun. And we'll cover this up somehow that looks nice. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll figure something out. I'm sad about this wasted space down here, but the irony is it didn't allow us, it didn't get us a third height, but it, it a third row for the top, like a third floor, and then it just, it just blew space laterally because when we go down one, it makes me add a foundation. Oh, I just decided to keep them all the same. The we Franconians identify as a different brand of people, so those parts are like abroad for us. Gotcha, it's like going on vacation. It's like, uh, so I heard it likened to Texas a little bit. Yes, it's the same country, but like, they sort of have their own identity within the country. I don't know how true that is, and, I, and you probably won't be able to tell me because only somebody familiar with both Bavaria and Texas would be able to um, answer if that is true or not. And that that subset of people is probably very rare, but uh, I did hear it described similar to Texas. All right, we're out of concrete. Let's load up again for another round of goodies. Our 202020 is serving us rather well, so let's not kick a winner in the ass. Yeah, building is downloading. You're filling your um, solid state. Yeah, I did. <laughs> uh, I, when I was naming it like SSD, like in the title i to i totally thought about that that pun i think our plastic is we, we don't use a lot of plastic in this setup uh what else do we need we need we don't need any of those we do need a couple of these and then we're good there we're good on rubber oh no auto save I do get it, SST. Okay, well, real quick, I have to use the restroom and it's auto-saving, so I'm gonna kill two birds with one stone. Uh, no pun intended, kidney stone, and uh, <laughs> I'll be right back.
All right, I'm almost back. Ooh, I'm just starting to feel like I'm I not because I overate dinner so badly. I'm just starting to feel like I'm not about to puke or something. All right. All right. Is my mic back on? Yes. All right. We're up and running. Uh, I need these guys. All right. How much space do I have? What are we short on? Grab some all clad looms. Um, where's our reinforced iron plate? Grab some more motors. All right, that's all we got. All right, let's go. Hmm. Like, why tell you? So that you don't leave. That's why I have to tell you. Maybe it's a guy thing. I don't know. Maybe it's just a me thing. Uh, m mostly, I was like, I gotta go. Don't go anywhere. And then I I made a kidney stone joke. And, you know, I lost control. All right. I lost control of the chat. All right. That's done. Finish out this row. And then I think we can do the second floor. And then, yes, we have to get rid of this. Okay, okay. Uh, the smoker. So. I've talked about it a couple of times, but um, I will uh, actually, yeah, okay. I, I do need to delete this. Um, <laughs> there's some drama. <laughs> uh, Kangralat, there's some drama. So the, the rules stated that it was gonna be by percentage. And I'm pretty sure at this point I got fifth or sixth in percentage. I lost 24.4. Uh, the person above me lost 24.6. And the person above him lost 24.8. So we were all in about two pounds of each other. Okay. Those, the three of us uh, in percentage. And then there was three or four people above us that uh, placed above us in percentage. However... I was announced the the winners were officially announced by the guy putting it on and he announced me in second place even though by the rules it looks like I should have been like in fourth fifth or sixth and so I'm not sure what's going on uh, but I hope I'm in second uh, he Yes, second place prize should give me because the guy that beat me in, because I lost the second most amount of raw weight, uh, 89.2. The guy that beat me lost 94 or 95. Uh, and he doesn't want the first place prize. He wants the second place prize. And so we already agreed to split if that happens. But again, even though it's been announced, I'm, I'm not holding my breath just because I know that I mean, there's some people, and rightly so, that were like, hey, the rules said this. Uh, you know, if you go by the rules, then, y you know, I should win the prize. And I I don't disagree with them necessarily. Ooh, steel beams. We're already out of steel beams. Um, I, don't, I don't necessarily disagree with them. They have a point. So I, 
you know, it's just one of those things I have to see. Um, I don't know what's going to happen, but the, the, the dude, he's a cool guy. He's not trying to like play any games or anything like that. He, uh, is he'll figure it out and he'll, he'll do what's fair. Um, he's already said he's going to try to get more prizes than he was planning to because he didn't realize how many people were going to like go crazy on this, you know? Um, and he's just like shocked that so many of us went so hardcore, you know? And so maybe what he could do, what I would suggest that he do is he pay top three in each category. So like I got second in the most lost nominally right so i get second right and then there's somebody if somebody did better uh by percentage then he gives those prizes out too so i don't know i don't know what's gonna happen but the first place prize is thirty five hundred dollars so i i only think one of those is going out So it, it is kind of what it is. Uh, let's let's do more of these. See what I need to bring. Because this is what's causing me to have to come back for more. Uh, so we'll see. I'll keep you guys informed when I know something. Uh, what's really crazy is that he's doing a Patreon get together, like a meetup in just a couple of weeks. And, and, and it's like five miles from my house, just where he picked to do it. And he's he does them all over the country, all over the United States. It just so happened that, uh, you know, I'm going to he's going to be in my area. So I'm going to see him in a couple of weeks in person. I'll chat with him. I think we're out of, um, I think we're finally out of encased industrials, you guys. So yeah, we're going to have to go see what we have. Uh, and then we may have to start labeling. We may have to start labeling. All right, Misfit. Uh, yeah, I think the build's looking cool too. Thank you, appreciate it. Um, all right, I've made an error. It's not too, too bad. It's fixable. Oh, super easy. Barely an inconvenience. I forgot to put, I made this little sandwich piece that goes in the middle. I just got to put them in. Uh, when you mentioned the rules, I pictured the nephew of Kyle from South Park. Yeah. So yeah, we'll, we'll see, uh, you know, I'm not going to argue for or against myself, uh, you know, we'll see what happens, but I really want that smoker. Now the, the irony is I won't even really be able to use it because I'm, I'm trying to move. I'm looking for, our, uh, 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 oh no, where did that go? Where did it go? Down here. That was so crazy. Um, so I'm not going to really get it going until I, until I move. My daughter's going into high school and, um, you know, I, the high school in my area is not very good. So we're, we're, she's going to go where I went to school. So I'm moving back to the, I mean, it's only across the city. It's not that far. But I'm, I'm moving back to the old stomping grounds.
Well, we're definitely gonna be packed in here, aren't we? Uh, yesterday I upgraded your AIO water cooling for your PC and had some troubles, but it's running good now. Good. Hey, Pee Wee's here. Welcome, Pee Wee. All right, let's get some flying output manifolds in, shall we? So I was thinking instead of labeling these like 200 and three and 202 and shit like that, that maybe we do letters for rows and then the numbers. I don't know. I'm still thinking I, I haven't decided. Um, all right. Did I forget the... No, I put them in. Well, let's put them all, let's put all these in here. Uh, but, uh, but yeah, to answer that question from forever ago, uh, I would totally do that too, by the way. It's just it would be it would be so sad though because I don't really have the resources to travel to different areas to do get-togethers for like my members or 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 something. Um, but it would be, you know, and I have so many people that watch me from all over the world, you know. But I would totally make barbecue. That's what I would do. I would do Texas, Texas style barbecue. All right, we are running uh, low on. All sorts of stuff. No, no, I meant what I said. I meant what I said. Pee wee. No. Uh, nothing from nothing weird from me. All right, let's see what kind of encased industrial beams we have down there because we're running a little low. But I remember I did double the production rate of encased industrials. So, and that was like an hour ago. So maybe we have more than I think. Do you need a case fan? Uh, if you're doing water cooling, you probably need some case fans. I'm not an expert, but I I like my case fans. Um, all right, what did we come down here for? We came down here for case industrials, of which we have none. Is that because I didn't turn them on? Let's turn off quick wire. Let's turn off rubber. Let's turn off wire. They weren't turned on. So I don't want to turn them on now because then it'll take time for them to be trained over. Let's just go grab them. Uh, they're going to be in the secret stash. Because that I have that filling up first.
All right, encased industrials. Show yourself. Oh, I also have another idea too. Yeah. All right. All right. We're going to continue the tour. I bet you I have some encased industrials over in this base. Probably not a lot, but I'll take what I can get right now. So we're going to we're going to head over to the water uh, packaging factory. If you haven't seen it, then this will be your chance. Here we go. Look at my beautiful train lines. Oh, I love them. They make me so happy. Even though I don't have any FPS. I think yeah, I was thinking about it because after the two hour attempt, it's going to be about five degrees Celsius, but it drops down very, fairly quickly. Yeah. So what I did for mine, because I have water cooled, I have a water cooled um, 3080 Ti. Do we have any? Do we have any? Come on. Oh, barely any. Barely any. That's like not even worth the trip. I wonder. I wonder if there's any at my, um, all right, let's, let's check it out. I think there might be some at my Fixmas factory. There's some more. All right, this was worth the trip. Hey, bro. I just got abducted. Rating all the goodies. Uh, what else in here? All right, this is all. Yeah, I was making stuff for here. Stars and stars. I don't think I have any more stashes anywhere. Unless I... Yes, I thought I remembered, but this is all... Oh no, there's some... Barely. Alright. Alright, we're out of here. Pet it. What do you do? Click on it. Look at that little flying guy. Came it with the blue nuts. Uh, I'm not going to do an auto save flying through the air. So we're going to wait. All right. So we stole all of the encased industrial beams we had stashed throughout the land. Uh, 
Uh, yeah, so here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking that we build a spreadsheet. Uh, we can build it here. And we do row. Yeah, let me zoom way in so you guys have a chance of seeing this. Row and then like A, B, oops. Uh, how many do we have? We have seven. So four, five. Yeah, that's not gonna work. C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J. Do we need 14? Four more. K, L, M, N. All right. And then we can keep track of how many are in each row and which ones are overclocked, okay? Mm, let's not do it that way. That's too comp. That's too stupid. All right, my auto save done. Yes, here we go. Oh my gosh, that looks so good flying through the air, and we're flying a little too too high. Now we can turn it back on. Now that I know where I am. Ah, oh, that looks so good. All I want to do is raid the pantry for. Uh, we were also running low on quartz crystal and reinforced iron plate. Good enough for now. This is the downside with blueprints, although I'll take this downside rather than not having this downside, but that it takes less, it takes so little to build. We spend way more time like managing materials than we do building because I blow through so many materials so fast. But I mean, rather that than, you know, the other way. Oh, thanks to update eight. You couldn't play anymore uh, because of your computer. And that's, that's what, how you found me. That's cool. Well, I'm glad you have a sh I'm glad, I'm glad you had a shitty computer. <laughs> uh. That's horrifying, uh, but hilarious. And we have way too many of these in our inventory right now.
Uh, we need iron plate. And we use a lot of iron plate. rubbers all right this is our last iron plate next run we're gonna need some more of that too let's just delete it and that wasn't uh oh crap i got full got a full belly uh we have too much concrete Becky, don't tell anybody. Don't tell anybody. All right, we'll come back and get that later. <laughs> okay. What are we gonna build? What are we gonna build? What are we gonna build? Uh, we were working on these little middle sections. And we ran out right here. for this That really stresses stresses my computer, but I love it. It's like my favorite thing to do. Exactly. Time to kill the frame rate, boys. All right, now we need to put in the flying input bus. And it actually cannot be like this. It needs to be out. Ooh, which means that. <sighs> Are they all going to be like that? Yes. All right means a change to the to the blueprint
some asshole deleted my modular frames. I actually don't think I have any. That was really stupid. That's why you don't delete stuff, guys. Yeah, I'm actually worried about the uh, inventory space mod. Gizmo? Apparently, Bits had to shut down his save because the some interaction he thinks between the mod the inventory space mod and the object limit and most likely the object limit memory leak he had to quit his playthrough because he's done was satisfactory until 1.0 um i don't know i just saw an announcement i i didn't have a chance to see anything else other than that so uh so i don't know but um yeah i'm definitely not inc i'm definitely not doing it twice <laughs> Uh, what else do we have? Do we have anything good in here? Uh, let's go ahead and actually turn on Encased Industrials now, now that Warning, the following may cause sudden outbursts of laughter, tears, and the occasional facepalm. Do you mean watching my content, Pee-wee? Hope you're doing well. Congrats on the weight loss. Oh, thanks, Killer Rain. I am. I'm just losing this battle that I'm, I, that I'm having against managing my inventory. Except for that, I'm doing great. How do I do what? Are you asking me or are you asking somebody in the chat? Gizmo. All right, load. We have to fix the flying one. Uh, the input. All right, so this should be a quick fix. All we need to do is move these walls out. Okay, that that should be it. That should all, be all we need to do. Good.
All right, I'm just concentrating here. Oh, all right, hold on. That's only one different, right? Oh, we have an error. Maybe. The high one goes into the high one. Oh, we were going to use, um, we got to use, uh, these, uh, not those. These anyway. Okay. And I'm hitting G to filter delete because these walls are actually in the wrong spot. I could make a blueprint to fix it, but then it would be wrong. When I go to build it on the other side, it would be backwards. So it's not really worth it to me. I'm going to need this on the other side. I just don't need it on this side, but it's already dealt with. That's one of those judgment calls. Like, do you make a new blueprint? Do you change the blueprint you have? Or do you just, do you, do you just fix the thing? I'd still be futzing with the blueprint to get that fixed. Um, okay. Guys, half of these are in. Uh, and I actually really want to document them. Which is going to be a little bit of a pain. But I think it's going to be worth it. And I think I want to document them from this direction because they all end the same. Does that make sense? So all of these in the front are gonna be ones. And then I think we make A over here. So this is actually going to be A. What does 10 look like? Oh, it looks good. All right. So I'm going to control copy A.
three, four. So what are we gonna chat about while I do this? Oh my god. Apparently nothing because I won't be able to do this without messing it up. Five. I could do story time with Kin. Six. All right, and now what we're gonna do is total. Uh, let's do first, second, and then overclocked. Okay, six, zero, and then we'll leave the overclock one blank for now because I don't know which ones I'm gonna overclock until... I'll overclock the ones that make the most sense based on the, the flow. Or like the supply of it. Usually another person to join me with inventory. I do, I do. Maybe I'll um... <laughs> Maybe I'll do this like really high membership fee on Patreon and and then uh, let whoever buys it, you know, play with me on my save during the live streams. I'm just, I'm just kidding. I don't know. I wouldn't want to do something like that. Like maybe I could do that as like a contest prize or something. I wouldn't want to relate that to like who has a lot of money. I don't know. But on the other hand, that's super dangerous to do because what if you get somebody that, you know, messes with your stuff? Of course, I guess you just back up your saves. But the problem is, I don't know if my computer can handle multiplayer, like, you know? <laughs> like, at least not right now. All right, so, one. I have so many ideas that I can't even get to because I don't have enough time. I wish I wish I could do more, guys. I wish I could do more. I want to do like fix my factory. I think that would, oh my God, I have to stop hitting the wrong button first of all. I think that would be really cool. Like people pay me to like review their factories and fix them and maybe like, and then I can make a video out of it as well. You know, like, you know how like, um, some channels have coaching that you can, like gaming coaching, I need six. I don't know, I've, I've fussed around with a couple ideas, seven. There's some cool, there's some cool ideas out there. Eight. Nine. I'm gonna try to make my first uh, 12. I'm gonna try to make my first um, guide video, the planning guide video that I've been talking about for a while. Uh, in the next few weeks, if I can get to it. I'm trying. Uh, okay, so that's 13, first floor. The B has 13, first floor, zero, second floor. Okay. Uh, yes, while documenting, I'm giving the time for the mats to be produced again. Exactly. That is sort of my thought process. All right, now this is row C.
I forgot B10. How's the trolling going? Like usual. No, I have B10. I got B10 killer, unless maybe I fixed it after you said something. Well, apparently Twitch is getting in on the trolling action. Killer Rain on Twitch is like, you forgot B10 and it's definitely there. <laughs> you guys are tag teaming. C4. Six. Seven. No. Eight. Nine. Ten. Non math by kin. I did two 11s. I don't know what you mean by that. Teen. 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 Sixteen. Seventeen. Good, that's what I had in my notes. 21. 21 on first floor, zero on second floor. Okay. I got beaten. <laughs> I've actually done that, uh, Killer Rain. I did, I made a macro. On Twitch, she said, I'm so lazy, I would make a macro to move my player over. I actually did that when putting in these ridge lines. I had to do the same clicks over and over and over and over and over again. I did make a macro with my uh, Razer Synapse software that did it for me. Now, where were we? All right, I gotta give them, uh, I gotta give these, all of these the D. Listen, I don't make the rules, okay? Give him the D. Or six. Yeah, it's usually about seven. Oh, double D's. <laughs> 12 is just not realistic.
have an idea. Oh my god. <laughs> I've already messed up my idea. Alright, we're gonna try this again. I don't think this I don't think this saved any time. E twenty two. Three twenty four. Five. Twenty six. Twenty-six on the first floor. Zero on the second floor. <laughs> uh, you know. Um. Oh yeah, let's fix this up. I promised I would fix this. point out, I was like damn they're good at placing those angles oh yeah 12 realistic depends on specific qualities the same person would put a number on every 10 or 15 but can a special one wants to put one on every machine yeah well you know I don't want to get lost in my own factory <laughs> okay so E D E and now I'm thinking I'm thinking we do like E1. Or floor floor one. And you know, I can't this is you guys can blame Darren for this. Okay, he It's his fault. Give me this idea. But I keep forgetting what number I'm on. Five. I have to say it out loud. Sorry. What I really need to be able to do is like hold a conversation. I don't think that's going to be possible. But 11.
The big thing is, is I really need to know how many we have. Uh, 15. Eighteen. Nineteen. Twenty-one. See. Twenty-two. And twenty-three. Uh, yeah, first floor. God, this looks really cool. You turn off my light. Right, this is what it looks like with my light off. Or up here on this. All right, nice. Okay, now this is gonna be E2. One. Oh, uh, it was 23 on the first floor. E is 23 on the first floor. Okay. Nope. Uh, not all rows have two. Uh, yeah, A1, A2, depending on how far down. It is, and, I, and I'm keeping track because I need to know exactly how many we have. And I want to do this once. I, I've like last night and tonight, I've recounted these things like 30 times. That's why I'm labeling them so that I know and I can just go to the end and it has the number. You know, I, I'm, I'm tired of having to count over and over and over again, you know, and I learned my lesson in the... Um, at the starter base because I kept saying, oh yeah, I really need to label these. I really need to label these. I really need, and I never did. And then like all the value, like all the, all the utility, by the time I labeled them, I was almost done building. Like I, I gave up, like the earlier that I label, the more, utility I get out of the labeling and so it makes it more worth it does that make sense because if I wait to label to when I'm almost done then I don't really get the value it's like you having to recount it so I just I've tried to label early and often And then I'll also be able to track uh, where my um, overclocks are. 13. 15. 15. So there's 15 in the second row of E. Okay. All right. A, B, C, D, E. E F. Uh, how many are gonna fit? I think I'm something like 30 short, but we're gonna find out.
a five. Oh, we could try our, uh, no, I'm not going to do it. Six. Nine. And... If I can do a rhythm, it's, it's, it does speed up. Do a spot check, make sure this is 16. It is. I know I'm labeling two machines. Yes, I do. I'm labeling them by blueprint. You have different shaders on those signs you use as a lamp. Uh, yeah, I mean, the signs I use as a... Shaders on the... Oh, you mean the ones from top down? I, I think I did that on purpose. Yeah, sorry, I missed that earlier question, Gizmo, about that I know. Uh, but yeah, I'm labeling by them by blueprint, not by machine. Because these machines, these two machines, they do a different job. Uh, since I finished my competition, what great food did I eat after? All right, so, well, just tonight, uh, we made homemade like really good uh, lasagna like not like you know a um, class like usual American home cook lasagna we did like hardcore lasagna uh, and uh, it was it was really good. I ate way too much. That's why I'm not feeling very good. <laughs> so that was tonight. Um, yeah, yesterday we made like breakfast sandwiches for dinner with homemade buns. So uh, we made like homemade hamburger buns, basically, um, or, or homemade buns that we used as hamburger buns. Uh, what else did I eat uh, this week? Um, Oh, we did a, a steak night. My wife makes amazing uh, steaks. We did a steak night. Oh, that's not right. Got to copy. Um, uh, I can't remember. What else did we make? Before. Uh, we did a um, 
my daughter made a homemade uh, big loaf of bread, like a boule, like a, a big ass loaf of like rustic bread. It was really, really good. We ate that with, can't remember what we ate that with, but it was really good. I had every meal like planned out this week. I mean, I still do. Uh, I'm gonna go back to my uh, uh, modified version of my weight loss uh, starting um, Tuesday. I basically have taken a week off from pretty much really worrying about food, uh, but I also did hit the gym. Uh, so at 12, 13, and I wasn't really doing that because I wasn't really eating. 14. Is that right? 15? Yeah, 15. Okay, second floor has 15. So 23, 15. Okay, nice. The F's are done. Now it's time to do the G's. <laughs> no, I mean like we made, the lasagna that we made was really good. Uh, we didn't eat it in a hardcore way. We made it in a hardcore way. Uh, oh, we also have a lemon tree, EFG one. And they kind of are all really ripe right now. So my daughter made lemon bars for us tonight, which turned out really good. G1. Well, it was a lot of Easter. That that's what I wasn't remembering. So so we had a lot of Easter food. Uh, we got a honey baked ham, and then uh, we had like multiples like sandwiches. And we made scalloped potatoes and stuff, and then we made um, again homemade rolls for Easter. Eight. Uh, and then and then with the leftover ham, we made um, like a navy bean soup. It was so freaking good. Uh, and then I have a couple things coming up. So my birthday's not too far away. And I want to really try to make um, really good Philly cheesesteaks for my birthday. Um, and I've sort of done it before, but the bread has never been right. You have to have, if you're going to do a Philly cheesesteak, you really got to have the, that hoagie roll. And you can't really, I can't really find those here. So we're going to try to make our own hoagie rolls. Um, and then I'm going to try a different technique with getting the steak really, really thin uh, because my I think my steak was a little too thick last time I tried to do Philly cheesesteaks. So um, so we're gonna do a test on those and then we're gonna make those for, uh, I always have people over for my kids' birthdays and for my birthday and my wife's. We have people over, we, we entertain and, and we make food. And so I'm practicing it for, yeah, I keep doing the same number twice. Um, I, I'm practicing it for my birthday, basically. So that's gonna be happening. My daughter's birthday, my middle daughter. Yeah, 20. Is that right here? Is this is this also 20? Yep. My middle daughter's birthday, she's like, I don't know how, I don't know how old she is. 11, I think. Um. You know, uh, not 13, 22. She, uh, we're gonna do hot dogs and hamburgers. And uh, I think she wanted chicken, I think too. So we're doing that. Nope, 23. See, I'm having a hard time holding a conversation and keeping these numbers straight. 24 and then 25 but you know it's making me it's making me smarter uh oh we need to put this guy in 
Oh, we don't have any aluminum sheets. Aluminum sheets. These, uh, these two here definitely need to go in. Well, I mean, I guess he'll go in when we start building out that row. So I won't, I mean, I guess we can put it in. Oh, that's wrong. Oh, I in the sky, you had a question. And I don't think I answered it. You said some rows have only one side blacked out, so the lights from the one continues while the white band ugly, while the other rows have every sign as all four sides blacked out. Looks better with them separated. Uh trying to figure out what you're talking about. Some rows have only one side blacked out. So the lights from the one continuous white band. Are you talking about these up here? Are you talking about the, the second floor ones? I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. The other rows have every sign has all four sides blacked out. Every sign has all four sides blacked out. Are you talking about this? All four sides blacked out. I have no idea what you're talking about. I'm sorry. You're talking about these ends? Some of this stuff just isn't done. Plus there's a lot of light that isn't on, right? This, this light is going to be on for everybody. It's going to change everything how it looks, but I haven't set that up yet because we don't have any power. Like a G6. That G6. Uh, I don't know what you guys are talking about. Sorry. Are you talking about this space? Maybe? Yeah, I have no idea. All right. Sorry. I'm going to keep on keeping on here. Uh, I just got to do the second row, the G2 row. And then uh, if you guys want to try again to explain to me, what you're talking about, I am happy to listen. And these are bugged, by the way. These are just bugged. If you're talking about these, they're bugged. If, you, if you're talking about that stuff, they're bugged. Don't even pay attention to them. How those are shining down. There's no power attached to these. This is a bug. If I were to save and reload, they would they'd be fixed. Yeah, look up. I'm looking up. I think you're talking about these. The white signs. Yeah, well, these aren't signs. So, so these aren't signs. These are wall-mounted floodlights, but they're broken. If you're talking about these, if you're talking about the wall-mounted floodlights, this is broken. This isn't real. There's no power on this. It can't. Power hooks up right in here. I, there's no power in this entire facility. That light shouldn't be on. It, it's just a bug. Don't don't stress about it. Uh, th those are all going to be like a light purple or a light blue or something. When I when I get the power hooked up, don't 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 worry about that. It's it's not real. It's a it's a pigment of your imagination. Uh, when I when I log back in tomorrow or the next time we log in, 
it, it won't be there. It, it, it's exactly like when a sign is is dark. Yeah, yeah, it's not real, guys. Don't worry about it. This is a bug. I'll make that a soft, like purple light or something. I'll make it good. I'll make it. I'll make it look good. Uh, I forgot to write down the number. When we get to the end, I'll record the number. Black pattern you put on the white signs. So you're talking about these. Those are all the same. If you're talking about these. Yeah, I don't know. You, you think those are ugly? I'm not changing them now. I, I mean, I'm going to be honest. Even if I agreed with you, I, I don't know if I'm changing them now. I think they look good. I think they look cool and different. That kind of reflect the, the red lights. But we won't know how the lighting looks at all until we get these, these floodlights turned on. Um, I and I'm, I'm definitely not changing it until if I want to change something I'm I'm definitely not changing it until we get all the lights in So that so that we can see what it really looks like six Seven Eight Nine but yeah, that's coming that extra light is coming from this. It's not coming from these. It just kind of looks like it is. Which is sort of the point. Yeah, the signs. I know there's a delay, and which makes talking, communicating difficult. Uh, what's wrong with the signs? The signs look perfect to me. I don't see anything wrong with the signs. They're all the same. Uh, G12. Fourteen. Yeah, signs are signs. I understand. But you still haven't told me what you don't like about the signs. You were talking about the signs. I think, uh, I think Gizmo might have been talking about the floodlight. Either way, I feel like I addressed them both. Um, I mean, I could build one here to fill in the gap, right? That's all, this is all I'd have to do. Right? There you go. Now it's continuous. I have that's I don't I don't think that's what you're talking about, but in just in case uh, you know. It's all good. Uh, 18 19 20 We're almost done with half of the labeling, you guys. 21 then we get to uh, build some more build some more shit Three Four Three five all right So Nice, so that's 50. I actually only had 48. I didn't count these last two for some reason. So that's good. So we have uh, 25 and 25 in row G, 25 and 25. Okay, so theoretically, our total here is half of what it, sh uh, of what it should be. 
Uh, I'm gonna actually put these in reverse now, and then I'll color them uh, like a like red or something. And then when I complete them, I will uh, uncolor them. All right, but now we can get our sum. Two seventy four, one ten, for a total of not oopsie. Try this again. There we go. Three eighty four. So we're short. Rules four hundred four minus. Uh, we're short twenty. So we're short twenty, which is which is not bad. Um, all right. He says he put a screenshot in the Discord. And I don't see anything. But I'll keep an eye on it. See if I can figure out what you're talking about. Um. Oh, you haven't put it up there yet. Okay, no worries. Uh, all right, so that's, that's good. So we're short 20. So what I'm probably gonna do is I will 50% um, overclock 40 of them, right? So I, I like that plan. It's killing you too from a distance. What are you guys talking about? Signs, there's nothing wrong with the signs. From a distance. It looks good. You guys are trolling the shit out of me and you're succeeding. Uh, all right, so we're gonna refill and I'm gonna put in all of these middle pieces next. And then we're gonna start the rows. We're just gonna we're just gonna work down the rows and we're gonna see what we can build with the materials that we have. And then if we run out of materials tonight, uh, we've been going for three hours, a little over three hours, and I'm probably gonna take it to eight. So we're not even halfway done. If we do run out of materials tonight, which is a possibility, then what I'm gonna do is design the blueprints for the other sort of jobs that we have to do in this factory. So, uh, basically everything we've been working on is the red, is the red one right here. Okay. We've got the unpackaged fuel, the diluted packaged fuel, so unpackaged oil, diluted packaged fuel, heavy oil residue, and unpackaged fuel. All four of these, each each machine in the blueprint, and then we need 404 of, because here's 404 packaged fuel. Uh, this, that's this 404. Now we have another job, the blue section here. Some of the unpackaged oil, not all of it, some of it goes to the red set, uh, but some of it goes to the blue set to make petroleum coke, okay? So that we're gonna do in the nose of the ship, okay? So we gotta figure that blueprint out and we'll do it very similar to how we did the red one, which is like a package deal, okay? 
Uh, and then we're gonna get the petroleum coke out of it. All right, and then, so we may do that tonight, is the blue one. We probably won't get to the yellow ones tonight. Um, but, you know, we'll see, we might. But, uh, but that's, that's, that's the plan. Um, all right, so we need to load up our usuals. Let's take, we need an extra output manifold. So let's do 30 of those. Um, actually, let's do 25. We know how many is in the row. 25 of those. Come on, come on, bro. And then we need 25 of these. And then let's see if we can get 25 of those. See, let's see if we have enough, we can get enough materials for all of that amount of work. Okay, let's get rid of this. We don't need any reinforced iron plate. We're good with, oh, we need one of those. that. We finally need more plastic. Uh, we're already, we do, we do not have the, um, encased industrial beams we need. I don't think we're gonna have a lot down there. I, I'll go down there and look. I mean, we, yeah, we, we have too much iron plate, way too much iron plate. And uh, way too much quartz, quartz crystal too. That's cause I brought those up, I forgot. Uh, let's get uh let's go down there and get whatever in case industrial we can uh, we we got i don't doubt that uh eye in the sky has a very keen eye but sometimes eye in the sky thinks i've done something on accident that i've done on purpose and it's not it's nobody's fault it just is a communication thing and there's been times where he thinks something is ugly and an accident Girl, I'm still typing. This is the first time that you look into the Discord while you stream. That's news to me. Normally, you do that only after the stream. I was not expecting you look there. Well, I mean, you know, I figured we would see if I... Uh, well, I've only built... Ha I figure it's this. If it is something bad, like if it's something really bad that I need to fix, now's the time, right? Um, Because I'm about to build the other half. <laughs> So I figure, you know. I might as well see if it's something that really does need to be fixed. Uh, did we turn off rubber? We did. All right, we're good. Unless some just got dropped off. There we go. There's our extra 21. Uh, Yeah, but here's the thing. Pee Wee, I agree with you. I agree with you. If you ever need increment numbers using a macro byte, pull over this macro creator. Okay, maybe. Killer Rain, thanks for that tip. I'll, I'll keep it in mind. There's a balance, right, Pee Wee? Because you're right. In a, 
absolute sense that you are right. Function first, <clears throat> cosmetics later. But I am trying to build cosmetics into my blueprints so that the cosmetics kind of take care of themselves. You know? And so if there's a cosmetic problem, I've done one thing two different ways. Are you talking about this one's different than that one? Because if so, I did, I, I also did that on purpose. If you're talking about the one in the center is different from that one, yes. I did it on purpose because I knew this would be in the center and I knew these wouldn't be. Does that make sense? There's, I can make these, like I can't make this one go, this one doesn't have an, a second one to, if you're talking about this and I'm just guessing at this point, right here, let me turn on my light. Yeah, I did that on purpose. It got, it does the same feel. But the thing is, is that I can make this shade that way and that shade that way, but these are in the center. I can't make these. There's only one. So I, I gave it a little corner. I kind of did it on both sides. It's not perfect, but instead of doing really heavy on one side and then light on the other, and then really heavy on this side and light on the other. I kind of did one where I was like heavy in the middle and light on, and, uh, 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 you know, light in the corners or whatever. But yes, I did do that on purpose because I couldn't make it centered otherwise. Yeah, I, I would have liked to use this design here, but then it, it would only be shaded like one direction. It wouldn't look centered. I mean, nobody's ever going to see that. Hold on one second. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I think he is talking about this. But this is a different job. This is this goes over the center the center run. These go over the machines. It's absolutely on purpose. It has a different job. It, this is lighting up the buses. Yeah, I. Yeah, that's that's what's happening. Um, all right. All right, we're about full anyway. So let's let's bust out these. And then we're going to drop down. Um, but yeah, it, it doesn't, it, it's performing a completely different job. It's not supposed to be the same. I had to do something that was on center. that didn't give me that like one sided look like I could do with the other ones because they're sort of facing the machines. Uh, as long as the, um, you know, as long as the bottom row matches the top row, I'm good.
Yeah, the idea is that it lights up the bus. Like this. Now that that's where that light is coming from. You know. Now, when I originally built it, I thought it would be lighting belts. And it's probably going to be mostly lighting pipes, which is a little bit lame. But, you know, at this point, I'm not going to stress about that. It is what it is. Uh, and there, it won't always be there like that. Uh, not all of those belts will be actually be in and not all those pipes will be in so some of those pipes some of those belts are going to be exposed oh uh did i mess up i messed up i forgot to drop it down Where's the drop? One more. There we go. Out of parts. Rubber sheets, all clad aluminum sheets. I think he's probably paused or hasn't caught back up to me yet responding to him he's still typing but it, he's talking about that uh the difference there but i like i said i did that on purpose i mean is it like perfect isn't it, it isn't exactly what i wanted but i think it, it's different it looks cool i feel so judged <laughs> Delete that. Uh, where's my my pipes? Not those pipes. Am I out of it? Am I out of them? Shit! I guess I'm out. Uh. Copper sheets. Thought I had a nice stash of those. Uh, apparently I don't. Uh, all right, let's, um, actually let's not do that that way. Uh, let's do this temper, let's, let's go pick up some more stuff. Get copper sheets and whatever else we can find yeah yeah it's because it's in the center I don't know if you I, I'm sure that you paused it to get the screenshot I don't know if you caught up and heard everything I said but it's because those go down the middle um, and they're shining straight down on something that is in the center of its blueprint whereas the other ones are kind of off to the side shining off to the side uh towards from the edge of the blueprint towards this towards the middle i don't know i don't know if that makes sense but yes i definitely did do that on purpose 
Now, is it, you know, the best design ever? You know, probably not. Would you have to hook up the power lines between the inclines? I'm gonna have to hook up the power lines between every single blueprint. Uh, and that does include, because blueprints, you can't really hook them up between, and as far as I know. Um, so, what else did I need? I, I think I could do maybe some more of those and some more of those. Uh, this is, I mean, this is about it, guys. We're, uh, I may have to set up some temporary, uh, encased industrial beams. <laughs> the, the problem, I in the sky, is that there's a, uh, a delay because YouTube sucks and it thinks that my 1440 by... My 4440 by 1440 or whatever it is. All right, I'm getting tired already. Uh, is 4K, even though it's not my widescreen. And so it's enforcing a 4K encoding delay between you guys talking and 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 not. So and and uh, so anyway, it's it's a bit of a pain in the ass. It's not your fault. It's not my fault. It just is. So, uh, whereas on Twitch, it, uh, we don't really have that problem. So when you're like, yeah, look up, oh, look back. It's already been like, like a minute and a half or a minute. Right. And so whatever you're asking me to look at is long gone. Oh my God, Becky. I feel like I've spent all episode just managing inventory. Oh, I need that. So I, I apologize. Uh, alas, that is really the difficult part of this game is inventory management. Um, but yeah, so I see what you're saying. How am I going to, I'll have to do something like this, right? And that kind of looks like shit. Uh, but I'm wondering if maybe I can do something like, there's no really sharp wall, is there? I could do something like this. If I want it. Maybe. I don't know. That doesn't necessarily look good. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I'll, maybe, I'll, maybe I'll futz around with that at some point. But yeah, I will have to put those wires in like that. Um, on the incline. Uh, 
speaking of that, did you see what I meant with the double ramp in VOD 49, I think it was? I can't remember. Can't remember, Gizmo. Double ramp. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> I'm a terrible streamer. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can finish up this autosave so I can get back to work. I know, Gizmo, I just can't remember. Yeah, 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 no, I remember you asking. I can't remember the answer. Oh my God, this is the longest save ever. All right, where were we? By the way, Ken at 1.5 speed is very enjoyable, or 1.75. Nice, good to know that my voice at 1.75 speed is very enjoyable. It's, th it's these signs that are costing me, by the way, it's all of these signs that I infused all of my builds, uh, my, look, I mean, look where the encased industrials are. This is the, it's the, that's what's eating the encased industrials. It's not like a Mark IV belt or something. It's literally just those signs, which is hilarious. I'm sorry, I like my lights, okay? All right, well, the good news is we are over halfway done. Look at how densely packed this shit is. I love it. Hey, Lightning Loki. Twitch. But yes, never do 2.0 for me. It will turn me into... So I actually am not 100% sure on how to pronounce that. Is that like Cthulhu? It's Cthulhu, right? Yeah, it's Cthulhu. But that's, that's really funny. All right, let's put these bad boys in. And now when are we dropping? We're dropping here. Put this in. And then we do it again here. And I think we're home free, right? It's flat the rest of the way. Yeah. We're almost out. No, I'm going to save some. Here's what I'm going to do. I really want to get this move. Ooh, wait, what's over here? Oh, uh, what's in here? Plastic and <laughs> nothing. Plastic and nothing. All right. Oh my God, that looks so good. 
Like and when we get the lights the way I want to, like a soft purple or whatever, uh, it's gonna be really good. All right, so here's kind of what I wanna do. I wanna map out the rest of these rows. Uh, the input, the input buses don't need any encased industrial. And so we can kind of like figure it out, right? We can sort of map it. Okay, so the first thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna come up and put that in that entire input bus in. And then it drops here. Oh no. Uh oh guys. Well, I messed up. Messed up a lot. Uh, these last two things I put in. How did I not notice that? Did I get it right up here? Nope. There has to be a space. There has to be a dead space. All right. Sorry. I, I'm going to have to fix that. My bad, Mario. Uh, let's fix that right now unless I, I thought I did fix this I just have Yep, these are wrong. Look at them. Look at them. They don't line up. That needs to line up with that. It's wrong. I uh, I made an error. My bad, Mario. But that's why they're blueprints and they go together fast. They come off fast. Let me fix this top row and then uh, I think I made the same mistake down here as well. I forgot that right here needs a gap. This needs a gap for elevation change. Regardless of whether or not you actually elevation change, right? Because this, this goes, come on goes here right and then this goes here and I just jammed them right onto the ends so that that was my mistake but we Vic we found it no worries And look at those belts running into each other. Uh, I don't know. I have to look. Is this song called The Slice of Paradise? Oh, dude. I don't know. Uh, let me... Here, I'll show you, um, 
Here, let me let me do it off screen in case I starts playing something or something that shouldn't be. Uh, it's called uh, it's White Bat Audio. Here, it's just white. If if you want to check it out, check out White Bat Audio. That's the name of the person who whose song it is. Uh, but I have it downloaded on a player because I was having lag issues. So it's not playing it from his YouTube. Um, although I did do that for like eight months. Uh, I, I was running into like horrifying lag issues while I was live streaming doing that. And so I can't tell you what song it is, unfortunately. Are, are these wrong? Yeah, these are wrong too. Same problem down here. Uh, look at those belts running into each other towards the gap. Uh, I mean, what I do? Do I build one backwards? No, these are right. Yeah, these are right, Gizmo. They work. Working as intended. Okay, so you know, we're 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 gravy. And right, now is that one on on point? Yep, that one's good. So the rest of these should be good. I don't think there's any other gaps. And and see, this is why I didn't do. Every time I do an elevation drop, I, I get more of those gaps. And this was the last elevation drop that won me a new... See how I can... I've got the second floor here because I did that elevation drop. No other elevation drops got me a third floor, so I didn't do any more. Because it, it only... It would only... Spend space. It wouldn't... Oh my god. It wouldn't, uh, you know, save space. Uh, just an optical illusion. All right. So if you excuse me, I need my sky eye to farm even more Easter egg chocolate and wow. So if you need a control full eye to spot unnoticed errors, well, cheerio, I guess. Yeah, okay. No worries. But I'm, you're all ears. Nice. That was two songs ago. I know it was two songs ago, Gizmo. It doesn't matter if it was two songs ago because I couldn't tell you the name of it anyway. <laughs> so I'm giving you the name of the... Uh, the artist so you can find it yourself. <laughs> yeah, 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 he's eye in the sky, not eyes in the sky. You can use one to play WoW and you need the other one on me, like uh, a gecko. And that's not a gecko. What is that? The guys that can look at, use their eyes independently. Uh, if I heard it, I would, I would know it. There's so much pollution in here. I'll need a hazmat tour, a uh, hazmat uh, to give a tour. Well, yeah, it's the empire. You know, what do you expect? And is that right? Is that, is that bang on? Yeah, that looks good. All right, now we do put the rest of these in. Actually, I don't even think I want to put the rest of these in. I want to save, I want to save what I have because, um, yeah, I think we'll be good. All right, uh, the error is fixed. It looks good, it looks good. Okay, so what's next? 
Well, next we actually have to fix this stuff. And I think if I remember correctly, when I went over there, we have to build this like all the way down. Until we get our first drop down. All right, now let's fly over here and take a look. Yeah. Oh my God, Becky. Thank you. All right. Then everything drops. All right, that's pretty easy. I can I can handle this, I think. Uh, just the first one is going to be a little bit of a pain, but we dealt with that before. We just have to do this, I think. All right, now we're doing the input manifold. Right there. All right, that looks good. There's a way to get it to go down and I can never, there it is. <laughs> I was like, and I can never remember. Uh, I swear, well, can we have the same train of thought? Chameleon. Is it a chameleon? Are they the guys with the buggy eyes? I know they're the guys who can change color, of course. I Yeah, I guess they are the guys with the, the buggy eyes, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two. I got two chameleon answers. Uh, one from Twitch and one from YouTube, so it has to be right. Yeah, the gecko, the gecko is the guy from, uh, uh-oh, something's wrong. What's wrong? Oh, right here. I mean, I made the same mistake again, but not for long. Uh, from the Geico, uh, commercials. Totally different. The chameleon is the the little guy from uh, Tangled, and uh, I have four daughters. Okay, so I'm intimately familiar with all Disney movies. Four daughters and a boy. We actually just watched Aladdin tonight, the old one, the one that was there when I was a kid. We watched that tonight. Because my uh, my younger ones don't remember watching it, even though I I know they have. 
don't remember. Pretty sure that that goes down and continues the same. Yeah. Put this in because it makes it look nice. And then I may recolor this black. I'm, I'm really happy with how this is turning out. It looks really freaking good. You know, and then we'll do, you know, something here. Let's, let's just put it in. I will do the colors later. Maybe I'll do, um, Maybe I'll do, I'll make some little uh, empire carts. You know those little droids that drive around the Death Star? Yeah, gecko cell card shirts. I was thinking the same thing, Zeph. I mean, I'm definitely gonna have some carts running around our giant uh, ship. Mm, you wrote it even before I talked about chameleons. Nice. Uh, well, and then uh, I, when I asked about it, Killer answered in Twitch. <laughs> yeah, you only have one brain that can focus on one thing at a time. Yeah, me too. And most of the time, my brain can't even focus on that. 44 concurrent viewers on YouTube. Thanks. Thanks guys. That's actually a decent amount for me. Mousito, one, two, three. So cool. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, but yeah, if, uh, I haven't asked this in a while, but if you guys could just, uh, if you're watching live, uh, just, give me a quick like on the on the video because it will help youtube share it while i'm still live if it gets if it has likes if you i already have a ton uh but if you if you haven't just hit that for me i would appreciate it and, it and if you don't want to then that's totally okay and uh you know i'll never know the difference um but uh if you had forgotten this is your friendly reminder Oh, another thing. Okay. Another thing. Anybody who is kind of like thinking about losing some weight or, or whatever, I picked up a kitchen appliance, a kitchen gadget called a Creamy. And it is awesome. It makes ice cream uh that from like protein shakes and stuff that actually is more like ice cream it doesn't it's not like a like a gross ice cream look at this why why doesn't it i'm why doesn't this this should have the corresponding piece it's so irritating that it doesn't. So now what I have to do is I have to do, I have to do this. And it doesn't even want to let me. Uh, 
I mean, I, it doesn't look bad. But that other one looks so cool, and it's such a waste that I can't use it. Anyway, it's called a Ninja Creamy. And it is really, really cool and really good. I don't know. I wish I could use that piece. What if I, okay, what if I did it the opposite? What if I did, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna use this piece. Well, maybe, 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 maybe. I said yeah a bunch of times, but now I'm a liar. Now I might be a liar. So I'm gonna use this piece. And then, it's not gonna let me like wall down, is it? Now I wish I could put that on an angle and make it go down. But it's really kicking my ass. Such a sad panda. Like, it could look so good. But instead, we get this. I guess that's what we're going to go with for now. So sad. All right, let's stop getting bogged down too much. Uh, Ninja Creamy, does it come in pie form? No, not that I know of. Uh, but anyway, it's making really, really good ice cream that is like extremely low in calories and like high in protein. And it actually tastes like ice cream. It has a consistency of ice cream. It's really nice. Uh, but yeah, it's expensive, but uh, it, for me, it's worth it because I can eat ice cream and um, that I make that I make myself. So somebody had asked what kind of foods I'm eating um, since I am done with my weight loss competition and I'm basically eating super high protein ice cream. I'm also eating a lot of popcorn instead of chips. Or you people in Europe would call them crisps, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> maybe they're called crisps. But anyway, uh, I'm so I'm eating popcorn because they're way less calories. It's way less calories than a bunch of chips. Um, we just go, this guy goes here and then Guy goes there. Okay. 
Yeah, that's the same thing. Doesn't help me. Okay. And now I'm kind of like doing the re reverse. Uh, there's a bunch of YouTube videos on the Ninja Creamy. Uh, and it's it's pretty cool. Uh, it was money well spent. It's going to help me uh, keep my weight off. Only in America. If you place a foundation first, just need to rotate at 45. Um... like way too much work but I do appreciate that it can be done okay so I could do that and I might do that but I won't do that today like if it really bothers me uh, I did I did know that kind of deep down in my soul um eye in the sky but that that was a good reminder it's not perfect but it's it's not bad that's not bad uh but for now so to keep things consistent we'll just stick with that even though it looks like shit okay Now, what's the deal? What's the deal with airline food? I think we hold steady. Oh, no, we go down to match. Okay, we're going down to match, baby. So this isn't right. That's what we're doing. Put in our fun pieces here. Come on. Matter, you don't like your home? Yep, that's what I have here. All right. And then that's going to go down as well. We evened out. And then we even up the whole way down. 
So this is also going to go down. And this. And I think we have plenty of the materials for this stuff. I'm going to put this on all the way down, but we will need to skip one. Where's the skippy? Did we already do this the last skip? I think so. I think so. So so we can we can just bang this out. Uh, because this because this one doesn't have any lights on it, it's not eating up our encased industrial beam supply. The whole bag of popcorn, small bag of chips have like 10 chips so I get like, so I can get two bags. Yeah, do you mean like, do you mean like in calories? It's like worth that money? I think that's what you're saying, Killer Rain. Anyway, and I, and we got like a really nice popcorn popper and uh, we buy some really nice popcorn, my wife and I. Uh, it's It's pretty cheap and it's really, really, really good. Uh, and it's freshly popped and I can snack on it and it's only like 150 calories for like two giant like like a giant bowl of it oh man and I mean I would eat a whole bag of chips for way too many calories you know what I mean So my idea is to kind of like get in the the skeleton while we wait for the parts to put in the the meat you know because these oh we're out of plastic oh but we have plastic right here oh we're out of concrete too but either way we can steal the plastic from here <laughs> uh, all right, so I can't repeat any of those jokes. Uh, the solution I had just now is awesome. Wouldn't be that different from what I said. I would just do it your way, less work. Okay, cool. Three, uh, three, one to hold the bubble, two to spin the first round. I don't know what you guys are talking about. All right, uh, let's load up on the concrete. And then uh, let's, we're gonna build a lot of these input manifolds. Let's make sure we have what we need. Oh, we're a little fat. Uh, I brought too much concrete. Uh, what? else we can grab one of those uh let's get some oh we need all clad aluminum sheets where did i hide you all right that'll cover us for a little while
Uh, yeah, okay. I remember now. I was running out of plastic. For this... Right, and then everything will be in place, and then we'll just bang out the the pieces that we don't, that we're waiting to catch up on, on construction. You know, but everything else will, will be put in place. Um, so, I do wanna put one on, I do wanna put one at the beginning of each drop down. Right, so we have so we have it where he goes. All right, so is this a second floor? No, it's a first floor, boy. Oh, and actually, we have to pull back two. So. He doesn't even go there. She doesn't even go here. I just have a lot of feelings. All right, so the one that goes there is this guy. That's backwards. Yeah, okay, so I still can't repeat any of the jokes you guys are talking about. <laughs> How many calories is a bag of popcorn? So killer rate, I don't I don't uh, buy the bags. I just uh I pop my own and like two cups of popped popcorn is I think uh 150 or 200 calories, something like that. Like a big bowl. And I get that when like I've eaten dinner and I know I'm full like in my mind, but I feel like I still feel like eating, right? I got the munchies basically. And instead of having more dinner, which will lead to overeating, which is what I did tonight and I felt like crap, then I, uh, Uh, have some popcorn instead and it's less calories and it doesn't make me feel like trash Yeah, what do you call a deer with no eyes no idea? Yeah, I uh, I actually do have heard that one and I can actually repeat that one I have a set of those jokes that I used to tell. What do you call? Uh, what do you call a cow with no legs? Uh, 
uh, ground beef. What do you call a cow with one leg? Steak. Uh, a cow with two legs is lean beef. Cow with three legs is tri-tip. All right, I'm trying to figure this out. Yeah, it's on the ground. It's one of these. <laughs> nice cow jokes. Yeah. Uh, oh, did I? Uh oh. No, we're okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. And those line up. That lines up. Okay, good. So then I would build those out, but we don't have the materials for that yet. So down here. Now, this one is a double. Uh, we can um, do two stories on. So it's the same as this one. Go. And then that's straight on all the way down. Okay, so that one's that one's good. Now are these flat? Yeah, these are flat. And then we come up. Getting low on case industrials. Uh, I saw it. I saw your ninja creamy comment. I did. <laughs> I chose not to read it out loud. That one actually did make me chuckle. Ooh, is this a uh, no? This is not two story, is it? Oh, it is. This is the one that we had to knock out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. Uh, we gotta, we gotta fix this. This is why we're here. I got to get one of these in.
Okay. Yeah, no, that'll match. Yep, that's what we did the other side. Good, good, good. Gizmo, I do get that one. That one is actually pretty funny. I sealed my I sealed myself out. Okay, nice. So that one's set. And then I am certain. Ooh. Yeah, this this one we have to really fix, I think. I did an inverse ramp up. Then I changed it to grip metal. Yep, you can't see anything. And then I can fix this too if I if I really wanted to, which I kind of do. Can't remember what I did over there. Go down three, I think. Oh, yeah. Perfection. Um, now we do need one of those bad boys. Go there. to think um all right let's keep on keep it on here i'm sure what goes here next is well we kind of need to go backwards We went up, right? No, not not yet. We went up here, and then we go out. All right, let's see the the double, right? Let me go up, then we go out, then we stay the same, and then we go up. Up, we go out, and then I need one of these. And then I need one of these. Then we have to put in one of these. Then we get to put in our new piece. All 
I mean, not our new piece, but our input piece. All right, let's check. Oh, and then we go up. We immediately go up. And we went up, we went across. I put this piece in here, then I built that, and then I immediately go up. Let me go out more. Yeah. And then we go up even more here. Yes, yes. Then we immediately go up here. And this is going to be a pain because it was last time I had to put this in. How many more did I build after we went up? Three. That's only two, so we're really, yeah, yeah, I'm, and then I had to <coughs> change the, except, all right, so we're going to have to move this. A little bit. Let's delete this one. Delete that one. That's two cargos deleted. We'll add the two cargos back here on the end. And the train station on the front. And paste in what I copied.
That looks horrifying. Uh, that looks equally horrifying. <laughs> Let's try this again. That's not too bad. All right. What's next? I would say, Gizmo, that they got, at least they got two planes. You know? So that's good. All right. And that's flat the rest of the way back. Well, kind of. Why did I make this so complicated? Um, is there one right here? Crap. I think we took a break of two. So we got those three. Uh, no, there's one right there. Yeah, okay. All right, just trying to make this even. I mean, make it, make it work. Just like I've done before, uh, but we're running out. I don't know why it did that, that's freaky. That's the first one in that row. I'm trying to get the first one in each row and the first one when a row changes elevation because then this is all the hard work. And then as we get parts in, I won't have to re-remember how I'm doing this. Like the guidebook will be in and then I'll just pop them in. You know, so I'm trying to do the hard work tonight while it's all fresh in my brain. Hey, Dad Gaming, how far do you complete? How far are you to complete this project? Um, well, that's a little question, Dad Gaming, because I'm doing, um, I am trying to build all the machines but it won't all be turned on. Um, because we don't have the, well, because I want to turn it on with drones, but we don't have the power for that. So we have to build, get the first half of the power running with half of the water and half the oil. 
and then and then we'll pause this work and we'll go and do we'll work on um once the power's up and running and we have a bunch of plastic uh we'll pause this work and then we'll go make a battery factory uh but i would say that i mean i only started building this yesterday this all of these parts i mean all of these um interior machines and um we'll get it mostly done tonight i'll be a little short on material but we'll get that when we get that um and then this is the red circled area 404 of them and then we still have the blue circle and then the two yellow circles but the the red circled area is the the hardest part or the 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 biggest part it'll be about once we get all the machines built two-thirds of the machines will be built in this middle section and then we're gonna build like a chunk up there and then the rest way back there um but we still have a lot of hookups to do like we got we have to run a lot of logistics a lot I mean, that's, that's going to take a while. So, um, yeah. I don't know. It's, it's really hard to say how much. Uh, but I can tell you that we have most of these machines in. I'm just really lacking in encased industrial beams. Um, all right. I'm also lacking in... Brain power. All right, now do we drop down here? So the, the extra long row, how many before we drop down? We do our first drop down and how long before we drop down way the hell down here do not drop down until These this guy pops to two-story we don't drop down until this point Ooh, did I miss something? I, mean, I think I made a mistake. I did, right here. I keep making this damn mistake. But it's okay. Better to fix it now. You guys love your 404 uh, error every time I say that I'm building 404 of them. You guys make that joke like every single time. But I mean, you know, I guess when that's all you got, you gotta go for it. It's fine. I, I get it.
Ooh, wait. Where's the drop down? The drop off, uh, it's probably right here. Okay, that's nice. Really nice. We're looking good. Uh, what's next? Did I bring this row out to completion? I think I should before I head back to the other rows. So once once he drops down, does he drop down again? And he drops down just on the opposite side of the last two story. Yep. Any more drops? Nope, no more drops. He's good all the way down. But he does go up immediately the right okay and so does this guy I think Let's knock this one in all the way down. Oh, are there any more breaks that I have to worry about? Nope. Yeah, that drop down's the last one. So we're good all the way down. not facing each other on the wrong side uh i think th i think they're they are did i make one backwards they face each other here yeah they face each other with the path in the middle they face away without the path in the middle All right so path in the middle they face each other um no path, no no catwalk in the middle, they don't face each other. Catwalk in the middle, they face each other. Does that make sense? Me? Oh, the flyby, you, you noticed that it's correct? Okay, cool, cool. Yeah, 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 no worries. Uh, yeah, imagine this without blueprints. Uh, yeah, I wouldn't do it. I mean, I almost feel like I have like a moral responsibility to build crazy ass shit because they gave us blueprints. <laughs> you know, it's like, well, I got to. All right, and then and then basically we're deleting like all this.
right, and then remember tonight I'm moving this wall out. We moved it out over there. It's a little hard to see. But we had to push this wall back to fit in more of these. See that wall? It goes all the way to the edge. But this one doesn't. We have to delete all this. Okay. It's like right to here. So this all goes. I did this to the other side already. We're just doing it to this side. That's a start. We go. All right, it's angled up. What are we doing with this? Get rid of this. First one from the middle. Is angled up all the way back. Then the second one. And I haven't even put those in. This gets easier on the outside because, or as I go, this is gonna get easier. Because I stopped trying to get them to, uh, get a second floor, a second story. Because I was playing games to get get this to be a second story, right? And then, basically, I uh, wasn't able to do that after a certain point, so I stopped changing the elevation so often. So it's gonna get more easy to copy. The, I mean, basically, after this point, they're all they're all even. Uh, we will have to deal with that. All right.
Uh, don't lie, you would have built this even without blueprints? And we would have watched? <laughs> Maybe. Thank you for the entertainment, Ken. Time for me to get some shut eye. Alright, night, Mikey. Alright, so I think this comes all the way down. Yep, and then I think this one goes all the way up. Or it, it goes up all the way down. Gizmo says night, Mikey, on YouTube. You know, I'm not gonna... <laughs> not gonna be like, uh, you know, your tra your translator. Yeah, so this one, and then it goes up all the way down to the drop. Okay, so I can put that piece in. Sorry, I... I, I hate having to go back and forth so many times, but it's better to do that and get it right. Okay, so now I think the best bet, our best bet is to maybe work on this wall here. And see if we can recreate what I've already done over here. All right, so it looks like I, I kept it up to that point and then Yeah, that's where the wall starts. So it looks like we come up two or one. One and a half. That's horrifying. But we're going to do it. So one and a half. And then I'm actually going to... No, I'm not going to I'm not going to worry about that. One and a half. So why did I, I think that's, there's one. The half. Uh, what's my wife's opinion about this game? Uh, well, I've played games, long games, MMOs, games that would eat entire weeks of my life long before we got married and I continued to do so in the 15 years since so basically you know 
It's all good. My wife's an introvert, so I'm the extrovert. Uh, you know, I just have to spend, as long as I spend the right amount of time with her, she doesn't, she doesn't really care what I do. And, uh, and honestly, this, this project, meaning like live streaming and stuff, you know, this is part of our retirement plan, kind of like my, you know, trying to save, you know, we're, we're, we're taking the money that I make and, you know, we're saving it. So, you know, um, well, some of it, some of it also we're kind of using to, uh, help her business. Uh, and her YouTube channel. So, uh, it's all good. I have an amazing wife who, uh, I don't deserve is basically the answer to your question. Uh, I want to say it's something like this, but I don't think I built it that way. How did I build it? I bet you I brought this wall down. Is that what I did? Yeah, I brought that wall down. That's, this is what I did. Right? I didn't do it like that. And then I did something like this. Right? Yeah, and then we just kept the wall going. And then I did something silly, but I won't do, I won't repeat the silliness. Do that. And then I deleted that roof piece, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Here, let me fix this right now. I don't know what I was smoking. There, a lot better. And I deleted all this roof stuff. Uh, but yeah, the ultimate goal is, uh, where my wife's business and this business replace our income along with uh you know my investments and stuff like that right i i don't know if that's gonna happen anytime soon uh but i do have some plans to try to eke out a few more dollars out of this channel uh with not too much more time invested uh i i gotta get my um I gotta expand my game selection for sure. Uh, and when 1.0 comes out, I will absolutely do that. Uh, I'll probably only stream Satisfactory one night a week when 1.0 comes out. And I'll, I'll, I'll play something else. Okay. So that's done. Okay, and then we dropped down. I had to do this weird drop down thing. So.
eight up, but then down two. See if I can recreate this because there, there's a reason that I did it. So I don't want to not do it. Eight, eight up. All right, and then we did, and then I went down two. And then I need to know how far. And then I think we go up. We go back up an amount. <clears throat> Trying to do all the hard stuff now. <laughs> all right. Let's do it based off of this. So we do it when we come up to the next thing. And it's roughly 17, 17 and a half. All right. I better do one on the end here. So we don't have the encased industrial beams for it. All right, let's pull this out and then let's go pick up whatever encased industrial beams we have. So that I can get some of these in. I wanna get these end ones in so that I can see. Yeah, we gotta delete all of this. And I think I delete that wall too uh yeah i've been working on the other side for a few minutes here yeah that that little wall thing is gone that's deleted as well hey zeph thank you for the 250 bits on twitch you're the man I, I appreciate it. Yeah, so this little guy is gone. Okay, and then all of this is gone. And then we're gonna go get whatever encased industrials we have that I can put in the end piece and be able to kind of like recreate the rows from this side we were sort of recreating the rows from the opposite from the from the other side but at this point 
I'm ready to do it from this side so I can make sure I get this wall built right. I mean, I know this wall goes out, but there's some funkiness going on that I want to make sure that I get correct. Uh, okay, so what do we build these walls with? Concrete and Get some encased industrial. Oh. See what we can do. I wish I had. I just, I've never needed this much encased industrial beams, but that's what happens when you stick uh, 400 or four of the medium sized signs that it require in case industrial on each of your blueprints and then you need 808 of them well that's not true 600 and uh 606 of them you know roughly so it's 606 times four times three <laughs> that's how many in case industrial i need and i burned through my supply and what do we got here Oh, we got some. We've got some. 600. So that's nice. Uh, there's going to be some in here, too. Where are you? There you are. 26 more. I got you. All right. And let's grab. All right. And then. Oh, we need motors turned on. All right, we'll come back later. All right, so 600 in case industrial, that's good. That should really finish off all sort of my reference points. So that, that'll be nice. I love how this thing looks. God, it's so awesome. Uh, what else do we need here? Let's, let's make sure that I'm not missing any other important items. motors yes we do and then a wire is by like right here I think there we go okay So next step is 
I want to build out this the first in each row okay so this one's gonna go here um and then i don't really care about the the second row or the second floor of each row that's fine all right and then that goes up okay Okay, nice. Okay, then what's next? Gonna be the output, which is this guy. And there's going to be another one of these, but backwards. That should have lined right up. Please tell me it lined up. It did. Perfect. It's exactly what we needed. Okay, nice. Now, those are the last. Uh, actually, is he? We have three rows with two floors. One, two, three. Yeah. Okay, so he's the last row with a second floor. Okay, and then we come up twice. One to the input and another. And then we have two. And then we come up one more time. And then the input. All right, let's see if I can remember this. The last of the second of two floors, and then we come up once input and then, then another and then we're flat and then once input and then nothing last of the two stories once input and another Okay, and then I said we're flat. Means that we have three blueprints in a row. <clears throat> All right, this is the first. All right, and then we need an output <clears throat> manifold. And then that's a second, and now there's the third. And then I think it was up and then an input and then nothing. I just want to make sure. Okay, one, two, three, yes. And then up, and then input, and then... Yes.
Okay, now the input. Uh, I'm sure you have to put in at least one row where you did not lower the machinery blueprint by one foundation But built it directly onto the first place that would make a huge Noticeable change well, I'm countersinking them Like I just like I just did uh, I, I don't think so Eye in the sky. I'm I'm building them the same way. I I think I'm okay. Uh, and then and then right on this there's no spacer on the right side of this input like there is everywhere else there's the there's a spacer or an incline there isn't here because i didn't have the room so then we're going to do one more full set of three of actually four blueprints but with no spacers That incline that I just put in there to the left of what's building right now, that's the last incline. Okay, so now I just need one of these. And one of these. one of those and then one more of these that's all she wrote okay nice All right, now let's get our wall in because I needed th this. Right, it holds steady here. And then right when it reaches this last point before it comes up for the for the input we go up four meter so it's gonna be something like Yes, like this. Take it out to here. And then we come up four meter. Did we come up again? That's to cover 
what we've done here. Before we come up. Oh, we come up and then come up one one meter. That's how I got it above this. Okay, okay, okay. Nice. That's how I, that's how I solved that. I came up one one little baby meter and then we're back at it okay that should be our floor let's get our wall in And then I need this and this. I better not do that, actually. I think that's what I did. I think what I did was this. Probably move those all down a meter, huh? I'm not gonna stress it right now. Uh, we, can fix, uh, we can work on that stuff another day if we ever even get to that kind of stuff.
Uh, let's see what we did. Let's see if I brought it all the way down. I think I did. I brought it all the way down, didn't I? Uh, actually, I covered it with... Oh, I did a four meter tilted wall. Okay. I did not do. Ooh. Yeah, maybe we shouldn't. Well, do I like this better? I think I like the other thing better. Yeah, I like that better. Matches what we got going. Yeah, that's it. We just cover it the best we can. I mean, maybe. Not necessarily. Uh, and then I actually had planned on changing this. the same here yeah but the thing is is i'm also working over here i this guy that's what i'm talking about i like i'm working on i'm working on it too i'm not just running back and forth you know uh, i could probably do the rest from the inside but this looks good from the outside So, I mean, yeah, I'm trying to avoid running back and forth, but I'm also just working. Um, this 
this look better yeah it looks worse all right let's just put in that in That looks a lot better. Uh, let's do the same here. Now I gotta change the color. Yeah, I think it I think it does look good in black. So Please, should I do the same to this one? Yes. I mean, at a certain point, I'm just kind of only doing what so it looks good from the back as far as you can see in, right? But then like, I don't need to really do, it's like an exposed underfloor, right? Like right here, it's like an exposed underfloor. I'm gonna make that black all the way down. So, and we'll do that from the top. Uh, okay, so that means I gotta do this and put in the wall. Because it transitions from being an underfloor that we can see to, to one we can't. So I'm at this moment in time, I'm not gonna 
color all that underfloor that we won't really see at least all of it at least from the the bottom i might do it from the top so that it matches from the inside i'll do that but i don't have to do the wall section necessarily um, I should actually okay so I'll take out to out to here all right now we'll do the wall and then I can change my colors I just when I change the color swatches per like so that they would build it really lags out my <laughs> computer uh so we're okay we're almost done but if I was doing an entire project then yeah I would not build it and then repaint it but these don't exist yet right because I haven't built those yet There's a better way to do this. I just don't want to switch my swatch over to to metal walls over to this custom swatch and then switch them back. Auto save. Uh, yeah, no, you're. It's true. Eye in the sky. I'm gonna have to figure out how I want to do that. I may change it all to be this black one on the inside, but I know it on the outside what I want it to look like. So I'll decide what else I do on the inside once I get in there and I start worrying about that, if that makes sense. But I do like the shiny black, but I also like the concrete, but maybe, you know, maybe at some point, I don't know. You know, and I could change it back if I really don't like it. And maybe that a deep black concrete will still look good. So we'll see, but I, I'm aware of that. Uh, I hear what you're saying. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, the, the buses are black, right? Yeah, I, I don't disagree with you. The question is just the material. Is it is it this fix it metal or do I switch it back to the the concrete right now I I hear you I uh, I'm I'm aware but I'm not gonna uh, I'm gonna make that decision when I get I mean, see, look, that's black, but it's not black, right? And, oh, well, why didn't that change colors to black? That's so weird. Now, what if I changed it back? Yeah, it's not black anymore. All right, saying it's already black. That's as dark as we get. So that leads me to maybe want to actually make it this fix it wall. I'm not sure. Uh, I'm not sure. But we'll see. And I, and I got it. We got to get the lights on and yeah, we'll see. We'll see. I'm, I'm undecided. We gotta get rid of this. 
but I'm not gonna stress about it right now. I just gotta get this in. And then, you know, once it's in, we can, we can fuss with materials. Um, am I leaving that? I would hate to delete it and then rebuild it. Let's see. I'm it's this That line up Oh, it does I don't have to I don't have to delete everything. I just have to delete up to here I guess that's okay. Well, I guess we're building it this way now. right that seamlessly blend in it did all right so that's good how far down that one goes we'll have to see and now I just need to put in this flooring or this ceiling I guess it is plates uh we saved some here for this very purpose i think yeah buddy
And then I think I need a little wall guy right here. Uh, good morning, Ken. Sorry I missed most of the stream, but one of my brilliant ladies came up with something that is blowing my financial mind. Been working on validating it all night. Looks good. Yeah, really lose the sense of scale. You really lose the sense of scale on the interior of the build. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's packed in so tight. Right? I mean, not this side yet, but it will. That side is just... I mean, I got these things packed in tight. Like sardines for sure. So. And I really want to get these, um, these planned, uh, like all these rows really kind of finished. Not, not finished in the sense of like them built because we don't have the pieces. You know, but the best we can. Kind of marked out. But we've basically finished renovating and expanding this side of the of the ship. Which is good. Yeah, I mean, I think this, this task is done. I mean, we gotta fiddle with these walls, but we didn't do that over here either. I mean, we're just gonna seal these up, right? I mean, I guess we, uh, I guess we could do that. Why don't we just seal this all up? Yeah, let's button this up. We just do better. And then we just need jammed up here but we'll figure it out maybe that's why I was waiting on it but I'm not gonna stress Uh, but yeah, actually, it's funny, uh, Jay Marshall, I've been, um, yeah, so I don't know if I've told you, I have a, I have an economics degree and I've been sort of, uh, you know, flirting with various investment and financial tools, so we call it, and I'm tired of, I'm tired of flirting. <laughs> so I'm, uh, I'm, uh, trying to, uh, 
get my shit together, you know? Ooh, we should maybe... Oh yeah, that's fine. You know, and kind of what I'm gonna do and try to, you know, try to retire early and all, uh, you know, all the fun stuff. I know what, uh, oh, you saw that little hole too? Nice. Yeah, <laughs> nobody will notice it till till we're in Atmo. Funny. And I really built this right up to the edge. Yeah. Well, and it's something I should have been doing a long time ago, right? I have the sort of base theoretical knowledge. I, I don't have the the practical, like, uh, but right now I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna research my ETFs, build out something that can, uh, you know, I can grow over time, uh, kind of a deal. You know, nothing crazy. I'm not trying to, Reinvent the wheel or, or anything like that. Uh, what did we do? I think I want to do something like What exactly did we do? We went up One And then the two walls. Okay, that's where we did that. Uh, hey Tom, I'm off to bed. Uh, thanks for the entertainment. Until next time. Yeah, well, thanks for thanks for being here. Nice. No, it's a cool thing, man. I uh, I'm jealous. That's uh, I'm probably uh, yeah. Is this the little hole that you were talking about? But on the other side, there is a solution for that. <laughs> and it's it's this <laughs> Hmm, I think that's the hole you were talking about But you know, I just kind of want to uh, you know learn and and take care of myself, you know what I mean? Uh, not be responsible for other people's money. <laughs> At least not uh, with that. I uh, I used to run a uh, I had an LLC and I used to flip properties. Uh, what did I do over here? Uh, and I, I gathered, I, I fundraised, and oh, I haven't done it yet. Why? Uh, well, I need to drop down, really, is what I need to do right here. Do this. Yeah, that's the right solution. That looks good. Uh, no, I went too hard into the crypto market. <laughs> I'm trying to, uh, I'm trying to rebalance the other direction. Uh, I uh, I have a lot in the crypto market right now, but I'm not as diversified as I should be. 
No, yeah, I I need to do and I and I will still uh I'll do better with crypto next time around. You know, and by next time I mean like you know, now. <laughs> but uh but yeah, I No, I have the opposite problem. The opposite problem. I went into that first and don't have anything else. <laughs> so. What is, can we? Nope, gotta do that. Okay. Uh, so yeah, and I don't really, I don't really like trading. It's too stressful. I, I did it for a while. I did okay. I didn't do great. Uh, I just, I just want to buy and hold and I, and I want to see some dividends and, uh, you know, I'll, I'll still, uh, you know, I'll still own crypto and, uh, but I will diversify better. I kind of went all in on one thing and it didn't really pan out very well. Okay, I mean, I'm up 350%, which is crazy in crypto. You, you like, I'm up 350% in eight years, and that's bad. You know? Uh, I already have one of the, I already have the sin. I already have the sin. There we go. Yeah, yeah, I know. Two weeks from the happening. Yeah, I'm already set. Uh, my my holdings are. I've been holding for more than a year, so I, I'll get the tax benefit. Uh, I'm not gonna be doing anything. I have my targets for my for my one crypto. If I tell you what it is, you'll laugh at me and won't even freaking. Uh, you'll never. Uh, I'll never see you again. You'll be like, this guy is an idiot. Uh, but I ain't selling it now. I've held it for too long, uh, but I, I bought in the red. I built my position. Uh, I got some, I got paid a percentage on it, like a dividend on it. So uh, I, I'm, i like I said, I'm up 350% on it and the run hasn't started. So I can't, I can't really complain, but if I had a, diversified it in other cryptos and 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 been smarter i'd be way way more up but that's okay what are you gonna do you live and learn next time too close to the rear side on the right uh i'll look john you got burnt 20k in crypto no, oh, you just placed a normal four wall there. No tiny walls. Yeah, I'll I'll look and see. Yeah, well, I did. I did buy on the. Uh, hey, Gary Wilson. Have you seen Starship Simulator yet? I'm not sure. Uh, no, I don't own Do Doge, Zeph. <laughs> it's not Doge. It's not Doge. I'll tell you what it isn't. And then when you say, if you, if you were to ask what it is and I don't say anything, then you'll know. Uh, I, this guy, I'll see if I can find it. I did not start three years ago. I started in 2019. So I missed an entire run, Jay Marshall. I missed 2021. And you probably know enough to know what I bought. Yeah, I, I think so. I agree. And I'm, and I'm sitting, I'm not buying anything. I'm not selling anything. Uh, it is an altcoin. It's not, it's not Bitcoin and it, uh, yeah, what I did. So what I did is, uh, in 20, uh, 18, 19 and 2020, uh, and 2021, basically three years. Um, yeah, okay. What did I do here? 
Um. Yeah, I did do that a little differently. I'm okay with it though. I'll see if I can back into it. I drove Lyft as extra money, and then all that extra money, I uh, basically thirty thousand. I bought crypto, one crypto, and I've uh, uh, about tripled it. Probably not three fifty percent. Probably two fifty or th probably two fifty to three hundred percent. Uh, so, you know, I can't complain about it. You know, I, I made money. I didn't lose money. But uh, I watched every other crypto go crazy in 2021. And I and mine just sat there with its thumb up its ass because of reasons. Um, so, you know, but that's OK. I'm in it now and I'm definitely not going to. Uh, anyway. I have a I have a different plan for the future is my point. <laughs> I have a different plan for the future. All right, so at uh I see how I made that black which I don't want that black there. What are we what color are we? Ain't that. Ain't it ain't that. It's this one. And then where do we switch? When do we switch to black? Probably. Yeah, that underneath side. It is not theta. No, 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 no. No, much bigger cap than that. Uh, top 10. Well, I don't know if it's still in the top 10 these days, but it was forever. Uh, Marshall, you're right. I own 140,000. <laughs> My cost basis is like 22 cents. Anyway, it is what it is. Uh, I, I could, uh, if I'd have done pretty much anything else, I, I, I don't know. I don't know if I'd be doing this. <laughs> Maybe you guys wouldn't see me because I, I wouldn't be doing this anymore. But it's okay. I like I said, I I've learned my lesson to not go go all in on one. Uh, I at least I didn't make the mistake of like buying high and selling low in a panic. Like, you know, at least I didn't do that. I made other mistakes. XRP. Yeah, XRP. Like I said, my my cost basis is like 21 or 22 cents a piece. So, okay, um, what's next? Uh, I think this outside is basically done for now. As good as it's gonna be. Ooh, let's fix this. Oh, that's the wrong color. Um, and that's, uh, I don't like that. Can we do better than that? Uh, but I'm okay. You know, you got to learn. And uh, if I if I learn... It's still wrong, isn't it? Why is that... If my mistake still makes me money, well, you know, I'm better off than some. You know, if it's an opportunity cost mistake. Um, I guess we're gonna, I guess we're gonna just go with this. All right, I'm not gonna stress about that right now. Uh, let's see, what's next? All right, let's, uh, we know the rows. You know how many are in there? I've already I've already done it. Yeah. Uh no, Zeph uh he guessed it uh in uh Jay Marshall guessed it in, on YouTube. It, it's XRP. 
I don't feel I you know it is what it is I I I'm not I'm not upset I'm not upset at all all right so uh let's see it's 6 13 and 21 okay so 6 13 and 21 we've already written these down that's two three four five six Okay, and then this guy, I mean, this guy's gonna go like way down. Let's go and see and make sure that this guy doesn't go up or down. I don't think he does, but I just wanna make sure that he's straight and narrow. Uh, and he should be the third row's length, which is 21. So let's make sure he goes 21 in a straight line. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I what I want to do in the future is, you know, buy like, you know, anywhere between six and ten, and just, you know, when one goes up, sell some. When it goes, buy into something else that's down. Uh, you know, rotate, not really trade. Uh, I don't, I don't want to trade. Uh, I'll rotate. Uh, all right, let's do one, two, three, four. It's like this is straight all the way down. And then we got to do our, our little gap. Right? It's straight all the way down with our gap near the end. Okay, I can handle that. Yeah, you guys, you high frequency traders, man, you're, it's crazy. That stuff is interesting to me and fun, but uh, I'm at a point where I kind of just want to freaking do something else, you know, and uh, not stress. Just hold my, hold my investments. I should have been counting. Hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um, I'm actually one of the reasons that I want to figure out how to keep stuff dividend rolling. Seven, eight. In case it becomes time to, dang it, I gotta go fill up. In case it becomes time to sell my my crypto right and i can pocket you know a good chunk of change i i want to know where to put it right where it's going to do some work for me and you know where it's not really going to be very risky um and then i'll i'll pull out you know i'll pull out some for hey look some encased industrial beams they were hiding nice i we needed that Uh, uh, that's, that's really cool. I, uh, ooh, piece of candy. It's like when you put on a coat for the first time in the, you know, in the, uh, in the, in the, in the fall and you find money in there. You know, those were my encased industrial beams the whole time. I just, I just didn't know about them. All right, let's get, where is our, there they are. And then... Oh, we're getting short on cable. Thought I had, there we go. I know I put him there. All right, where was I? I lost my count. I think I was at eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, we're at eight. And how uh, how far are we going? 
We're going to 21, I think, or 26. Six. 13, 21, we're going to 21. And that's eight. Nine. Fourteen. Fifteen. Okay, here's our, here's our, okay, we're at 15. Okay, and now we got to do our little our little game. Now this will be sixteen. Seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Was it twenty one or twenty three? Uh, I was twenty one. Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one. Okay, cool. So that's in. Now let's see what next. Uh, I just did this line. I just built this line right here. All right, and so it goes down until that little break that I did, and then it goes even. Okay. All right. Yeah, that makes sense to me. There's a little break, it goes down, and then from here, it goes even. And this is the last one, and I want to build the last one. I think that's good. do this bad boy and this guy in reverse 
and it should line up perfectly. And it does. Yeah, and it was 21 and then 23. That's the next two on the list. Yeah, tw uh, no, 21 and 26. Oh, it goes, oh, it goes all the way down. Okay, okay. Yeah, and four more. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, one, two, three. There's the other six. Okay, I think. Um, there's a mistake. Where's my mistake? I found it. That's a mistake. It's right here. Oh yeah, I make that joke too. Actually, I was a little nervous because I think, although I think I've told him before, my dad made a Bitcoin joke to, like today and I'm like, oh no. But I think he was doing it. He was messing with me because I've made, I've, I've made that joke before. I was like, when grandma starts talking about Bitcoin, it's time to sell. Are we sticking through the roof here? Oh my god, we are. Kinda. Yeah, we do kind of stick up, don't we? Well, uh... Oh well. Yeah. The ETFs are going to be interesting. And the uh, happening, just like always. I'm, uh, you know, looking forward to it. And uh, maybe it's, maybe I can actually, uh, you know, I mean, cause if I can trip, like if it triples up from here, right? I'm already tripled up. <laughs> Does that make sense? So like, I'm, I mean, I'm sure you know. So I'm, you know, I don't need a lot to really be a, a life changer for me. It's a steam vent, right. Okay, so. Let's go ahead and put in this one. We're really close here. To really being able to kind of Put this to bed until we have everything that we need. That's really pretty.
I think I have these levels mapped out exactly where they should be. I just wanna get a couple more of these blueprint sets down. Now, I'm just happy we finished the renovation of the ass end of our ship here. Yeah, I was talking about just uh, XRP sp specifically, Jay Marshall. <laughs> It's like, ah, oh, that's all I want. Just all-time high. Give me back to the old all-time high. I'll be a happy, happy man. And then uh, I'll buy, I'll go buy a house with no mortgage. Uh, or better, actually. Uh, but so my background's real estate. I've been a realtor for f 12 years now. Fif no, 15 years, 16 years. And um, like I said, I used to flip houses. And so uh, I had to go, f you know, fundraise. And uh, I don't, I don't want to, when it's time to flip houses again, I don't want to fundraise. I want it, it to be my funds. You know, I don't want to make a bunch of money for other people like I did last, like I did from 2008 to, you know, 2014, basically. I made other people money. I want to make myself money. You know, but you gotta have money. So that's that's my general plan. Cause I uh, I buy uh, I buy at the courthouse steps. I used to. I don't I don't do it right now. I uh, I got pretty good at it. And that time I think is coming again. All right, that looks good. Now we're going to come up. Oh, let's get rid of these. <laughs> well, you know. That particular surgery. All right, did I fix this? I think I did. But yeah, man, that sounds like a cool job. Like, I would enjoy that job. Not that I want a job job right now, but if I had to pick a job, that sounds like a sick job. Um, okay, so we kind of have like these haphazardly in so that I can kind of build them out easily when the time comes. Uh, but I, I think we're gonna need a shit ton more. Encased industrial. So here's what I'm thinking that we do. Cause we're gonna need a lot more. Um, I mean, we're basically, our hands are tied until I can get the rest of the stuff in. And so I think what we do is we play a little game. And that game is how can we increase our encased industrial beams quickly so that we can continue building this and not get hung up on our lack of encased industrials. So, let's see what we have to work with. Uh, let's head over here.
I actually don't think we're really dumping any steel product right now. I'd be surprised if we're dumping any steel product. Now we are dumping some concrete, but I tend to use up concrete fast. Yeah, let's play a game. So I don't want to use up this concrete. I need concrete and coal. Let's make a really shitty blueprint. Let's make a let's make a quick and dirty. All right, you guys ready? Quick and dirty blueprint. Um, where do I want to go on the map? Because I have some alternate recipes. So I think I know where I want to go. Uh, where's our map? This is not our map. This is not. This is not my beautiful house. This is not my beautiful wife. Here it is. Here's my beautiful map. Yeah, I think so too, Jay Marshall. Like I said, I uh, I learned my lesson, but I'm in now. And uh, watch me sell in the day after it goes 10x, because uh, that would that would that would be me. Uh, and then we're gonna need some iron ore and and or maybe some copper ore. So what are what are we what can we do here? Uh, we need coal. We're using all of this coal. Uh, we're not using this coal at all. Uh, is there something easier? This is pretty good. We got limestone here and here. We got coal here. We have a train going right through here. And then we have copper and iron. So we can build a little a little guy quickly. Quickly and ugly. Right here. All right. So we have we have everything we need and I'll do the copper iron uh Deal. Let's get some rotors. And I'll probably need some modular frames as well. Some rotors. Uh, better get some of these. I think we have all the rest. Oh, uh, and better get some of these. We've got to like quadruple our. Encased industrial production. All right. Um. Impacted. Uh, I could do solid steel. Yeah, okay. Yeah, solid steel. But before we do the solid steel, we got to do... Oh, I think... Was it double foundry? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to double foundry.
that inside the blueprint? It is. Nice. Um, it's 50 per minute. Uh, what do we need? Uh, we need 40 per minute. So we make this 40 per minute. And then we do this. Put our splitter in. All right, I'm just banging out a quick and dirty here. All right, and then uh, merger on the front. Sorry, hitting the wrong buttons. Right? And we get 60 out and we just throw a bunch of coal in here. I'm not gonna, I'm not really worried for about perfection. This is not gonna win any awards. Going fast and crazy, fast and crazy. So this would pump out uh, 180 ingots per minute. goes in copper goes in and then coal goes in here and um ironing gets come out here i mean stealing gets come out here all right plop down a mark three power pole right in the center Uh, is this done? Hold on. Hold on, guys. I got to deal with a problem. Okay, I'm back. <sighs> All right. My two-year-old is, was up and 
throwing a fit. Iron ore, copper ore. Uh, let's do iron, copper, coal in, um, steel out. Okay. Uh, this is a quick and dirty blueprint for making steel. Uh, because we are not making enough, um, uh, encased industrial beams to build my factory. So we've got to do a, a quick little satellite, uh, production. Okay. So that's to get the steel ingots. Uh, now we need assemblers. Well, constructors first. And and I'm just uh like I said, I'm not I'm not going to win any awards here. I'm just trying to get this thing knocked out. All right. And so what are our options here for in case industrials? We have two. Five and four uh, or seven. That makes steel pipe takes three. I think it's the steel pipe one. Don't we want the steel pipe one? Oh, that takes seven. That takes four. Okay. Well, all right. Come on. Hold on here. All right, 30 gets you 20. Yeah, let's run the two options here. All right, 60 gets you 15. Yeah. 30 gets you 20 here. And then... That could you four. That gets six, but it takes 24. Twenty concrete, 30 concrete. I mean, I think it's this uh, steel pipe. 28. Uh, we overclocked this to 28. Okay, and 20 concrete. I think that's what we're going to do. Um, unfortunately, uh, I need to double floor this. So I can make my concrete. Yep. Now. See if I can make 
these line up directly. Um, <laughs> yeah, this field is looking phenomenal though. Just make sure there's no, uh, open reactor core vents in the, uh, the deep trenches, right? Do, the family guy star Wars has like my favorite joke on that. He's like, no, it was kind of a, kind of an aesthetic choice by the architect. You know, it's, it's really funny. Uh, but yeah, these two blueprints that I that I'm like just banging out fast uh, It's just so that we can get like I Can make a bunch of an encased industrial and we're not even gonna transport it anywhere. I just want it like make like Like being made and then we'll fly over and pick up an entire like four bins uh, Yeah, sounds good Jay Marshalls, good talking to you about that stuff. I'm, I'm always interested in trying to expand my knowledge, you know? So I appreciate you being free with uh, your knowledge. Longest auto save ever. Come on, bro. Uh, I have about an hour left, so we're definitely going to set up our... Um, encased industrial beam specialty shop. Okay. Get rid of this. Get rid of this. All right now, how many do we need? We need 20 concrete per minute. We only make 15, that's why God invented power shards. Last time. Limestone goes in here. Steel goes in there. Encased industrial comes out there. 
and we can line them up okay uh what did i name my other thing what stupid naming convention did i come up with iron co uh copper coal in steel out so this is going to be steel lime stone in uh encased industrial beam out all right let's bring enough for like five of each more rotors oh let's clear clear the designer Okay, we got plenty i'm just gonna delete this so i don't have that stupid problem that i sometimes get oh nice huge storm and the wind is super loud well that's kind of cool all right let's uh bring a little bit of extra cable for power lines am i full oh i'm a fat boy uh let's do uh one more of these all right let's go Oh, I need, uh, I don't know if I have the mining stuff. Crap, crap. Uh, just portable miners. All right, I have everything else. All right. Okay, we're gonna make this on the lake. All with blueprints so we can delete it fast. I need to build it down there. Three out of the, uh, now I'm dropping shit. Uh, most of what I need is down there. Only the coal is up here.
Okay. God, it's still not far enough. All right, where's some space? the iron okay, it's right there where's the copper all right we're building it down here we're building it right here that damn uh hole over quick and dirty quick and dirty we gotta go Good enough. All right, here's the copper. the iron uh, there's a lava biome I could oh I forgot I need two for each I could use yeah Vader's uh, Vader's castle on Mustafar Two more, I think.
All right. Last one. Right here. Remember, I'm not trying to win any awards, people. We're just trying to get this going. Because I'm tired of running out of this shit. Nobody got time for that. All right, this is like the fastest automation of encased industrial beams you ever see in your life.
Uh, steel on the bottom, right? Yep. The limestone. Oopsie. No, I just forgot a belt a bunch of times. Connect these. And then we profit. Never, <laughs> I'm never gonna be able to finish that uh, the Super Star Destroyer without an alternate source of encased industrials. I only have two assemblers making them right now. And then I think I just threw down nine. <laughs> uh, with these blueprints. So, you know, four and a half times. Uh, I've been working on this for 45 minutes. <laughs> uh, speed running. This is where we are on the map right here I pulled that down pulled that down and that and we're just building like right there all right now I don't want these to overflow so we're gonna make a big old bank
There we go. All right. It's our hold up. I forgot to load. Okay, so that's gonna help. It's getting stuck. Um, <laughs> I, uh, it's very confused. There we go. Uh, Sultic, uh, and Mandricol. So I, um, encased industrial beams. Uh, are really running out fast on the beast. And so I'm making a little uh, satellite. In case industrial beams production. Do we need more steel? Is that our hold up here? Looks like it is. Let's uh let's expand. Production has expanded. Oh, that that that's not helping. Uh, no wonder. I forgot those hookups. That's gonna help a lot. Uh, we need power. Oh, the baby ones, you're right. The ones that I broke and then haven't fixed yet. Good call.
What's our hold up here? I bet you it's concrete. Uh, yeah, it is. Well, it's limestone. So, let's hook in some more limestone and then I think we, we can run off and do something else. Pipes more efficient. Yeah, I thought I remembered the pipes being more efficient. I'm glad I designed that with that in mind. And I didn't feel like doing the math to like make sure. So this is eaten 60 times one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 60 times nine. I'm too tired to do it in my head, 540. So we're not, we're not eating all the limestone here. So we can, we can add on. Uh, we've just got to Kind of redo this for a second. is pretty good. Uh, it's not perfect efficiency, but I, I just don't care. So it's perfect for me. <laughs> okay, cool. So let's grab what we can. And we're going to let this little mini factory crank away I, I i built that in an hour designed it built it in about an hour so he's off there doing doing his own thing and then i'm not even going to worry about transporting it into a useful place I'll just go and grab it all. All right. 
so we have a bunch of people that just joined uh and so i'm going to take a second to kind of catch everybody up and we are going to grab whatever industrial beams we can over here and we're going to build whatever we can in terms of blueprints and we're going to chat a little bit i'll show you guys what's going on inside the star destroyer but basically long story short which in my case it's always too late uh to make my long story short uh we i designed my blueprints to need way too many encased industrial beams compared to my production rate of encased industrial beams uh i like my lights i'm sorry i, I won't apologize although i guess i just did oh yeah look at that so we're, we're making like five times more than that still 13 likes ramp it up kin ramp it up kin 13 likes i don't know i don't know what you are saying because the live stream has 37. Yeah, I see 37. I don't know what Gizmo is smoking. All right, so here's the beast. And I want to start putting in these. The best we can, at least. So we will run out of... Oh, we can do... Oh, we can do a decent amount. All right, nice. Uh, let's load up with what we can then. We're about we're a little full though. Let's get motors. Uh, we need a crystal oscillator. Where are you? Where did I stick you? There you go. And we need a rubber. Uh, that's pretty good so let's let's throw some in and then we'll go all right let's get in these weird these this weird crap um is it both sides i can't even remember no it's only the side facing the outside Ooh, what's this bunch of concrete So let's see if I can get it to place. Well, I should be able to. I just turn it on. Yeah. Yep. And so what these blueprints do is they take. Packaged water and packaged oil and they expend fuel. And uh, resin and empty canisters. All right. Ooh, did I make an error? I did. 
Thought that was too easy. I was off by one. I hate it how it does that like little half thing. So it means I gotta do this. Um uh, more, more, more do. Hey, Ken, everyone. Looks like I've missed quite a lot since last time I checked. What are you up to, Ken? What's the plan? So, I'm building a Superstar Destroyer power plant. And, and by the way, uh, not that I won't answer your question, because I absolutely will, but if, you, if anybody's watching and they don't know what the heck I'm doing, uh, the your best bet is to uh, maybe when this stream is over or whatever is actually to view I have a a video where I uh, have kind of gone into depth on what I'm doing and why it's edited it's 17 minutes I pack a lot of information in it right now I'm gonna be trying to answer this question while sort of uh, playing the game but I actually made a video specifically about updating what I'm doing. It's called, uh, that's no moon. <laughs> All right. So that's the name of the video. Uh, you guys feel free to check that out. Um, and that'll give you a better, more in depth answer than I can probably do now, but I will try. Uh, but basically I'm building a Power plant that uses all the oil on the map to make uh, power, oil, and rubber, and petroleum coke. And it's shaped like the Super Star Destroyer. Let me give you guys a quick look. There you go. That's how it looks. Uh, is your flight not even get like a jetpack? Yeah, Pyro, no. I have a cheat mode on. Advanced game settings for the flying. There is a mod for it, but I don't use that mod. I just use the in-game, the in-game dealio. Uh, advanced game settings. There we go. Um, and so we're, we're auto saving. So let me show you guys. So this is the plan a hundred uh, 10,500 packaged oil comes in um, 31,200 packaged water comes in those are the only two inputs and We use those various items the red circled Nodes are the blueprints that I'm making. I need 404 of them uh, And that's gonna produce all the fuel Okay, all this fuel that is mostly going to be used for power but we're going to be using some fuel to uh supply our plastic and rubber uh, necessities really the plastic uh, and then uh that's the red that makes all our fuel and then the blue makes all of our petroleum coke and then the combination of these two and then this yellow makes all of the rubber uh, I should actually make those different colors huh let's I was sort of thinking them at, as they were the same thing but they're really different this one makes rubber this one makes plastic so I need to think of them this one makes fuel so we have one that makes fuel, one that makes petroleum coke, one that makes rubber, and one that makes plastic. And they share interconnections, right? Because, like, you know, this polymer resin is going to be needed, right? You know, and water and fuel and, yeah. So, there you go. 
Um, and then I basically have the plans where I'm gonna build all these worked out. Uh, the big boy is the one that makes the fuel. That's what we're working on right here. Yes, unlimited power. So yeah. All right, so that's good. Let's put in the output uh, blueprint. You're not gonna, you're not gonna build for me. You wanna try this again? Better. I got better. All right. I wonder if we can just put in, let's put in all the output. That'll really help me visualize where everything goes. Let's see if we get all the output manifolds in. Oh wait, I think I made an error. That same error that I always make. Yes, at least I caught it sooner this time. Come on. go all the way to there and then it will go down so basically I've, I've I've chopped my blueprints into three um and there's different variations of these three but there's basically three there is the the main blueprint right that has our machines and then I have an um one on each side one that does sort of the output and you know, output manifolding and then the input manifolding right and then I'll just have to connect these together but pretty pretty happy with this so far this method uh, it, it, it's allowing me to build things really fast and hopefully it all works right we can only hope yeah I can't really imagine doing this without flight either I Don't really think, I mean, anything's possible, right? But like, it just doesn't seem worth it. All right, we're out of copper sheets. You know what my favorite part of this is? Yes, it connects. Grabbing some goodies. Um, I hope I still have copper sheets up here.
Apparently, I don't. Uh, we need copper sheets. There they go. There they are. All right, nice. And then... I used up my stash that I had over there. All right, well, let's use up what we have now, and then we're going to go get copper sheets and iron plates. How's my time? I'm getting a little bit close to the end here, but I'm going to keep pushing. <laughs> right, right, right. Lower accurate. We'll definitely go with that. In space by droids. They could fly. <sighs> Coffee stain asks the impossible. I need more men. 1.0 is coming out. Uh, let's go this way. I feel... Uh, how far does this one go? We have... Um, I know that one goes to there. Uh, I wrote it down somewhere. Should I write it down? 13. Okay, so we need, that's one. We need 12 more. That's uh, three total, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine and eleven, twelve, thirteen. Uh, that's the wrong one. So is that. Those are the wrong ones. Dang it. But easy enough fix. I love blueprints. I put the one on there. These these pillars here are for when they. Oh, that was kind of dumb, wasn't it? It'll turn out okay. Uh, those pillars are for when I'm stacking another one on top. Uh, so I, I had just built the wrong one, that's all. Uh, all right. Speaking of which. Build these one on the end. Build these ones on the end. Oh no, oh no, oh God. up all of our goodies let's go grab some more goodies hey let's go Brandon uh, good morning afternoon evening hey how's it going 
I am sort of kind of wrapping this up a little bit. Uh, we're going to do one more run of material. Okay, so I'm going to drop off everything that I have in my inventory right now. And then I'm going to go and pick up whatever encased industrials we can. Uh, and and we still have some here, which is good. Uh, we actually didn't run out of those. We ran out of uh, copper uh, copper pipes. But uh, let's go our copper sheets. Let's go get our. Let's fill up on encased industrial copper sheets, and then iron plate. I think is also we're a little short on. Yeah, I, I I think so too, Mandrical. I, I know a lot of people say, oh, they need to be bigger. I think you can do an incredible amount with them if you kind of think about them sort of like recursively, you know, and repeatable. Um, no, it'd be cool if you could kind of change its shape. Like I'd love to make like long, thin blueprints you know, like the same, like maybe if I could rearrange the the volumetric shape of the blueprint would be fun, but that would probably be really difficult to like implement. But like, I wish I had more flexibility in shape, I guess. Uh, but I can't complain. I I love the blueprints and I do crazy shit with them. So I do want to get a feel for how much got built in really we've only been gone for like a half an hour if that for this is our little uh case industrial beam yeah so not a ton a ton but you know, we could go for one, two, three, four, five, like eight hours, maybe. That might fill up in, in, in somewhere between six to eight hours. That would be good. All right, man. You're going to have to go catch a stream later. Well, thanks for stopping by and saying hi. Trying to think if there's anything else we were short on except for copper sheets. Motors, maybe? Right, that's what I was thinking, Gizmo. It would be cool if I could do, yeah, or like make them shorter and longer. I've only really got about 10 to 20 minutes left in me, guys. We're gonna grab this. And then um, I'm gonna empty what I can. What else were we sh getting short on? Maybe some of these. I think everything else was looking good. Yeah, let's go.
Yeah, I agree, Madrigal. I I 100% agree. I mean, we would I wouldn't be able to make this. No. Uh, so I I'm with you. I think Blueprints opens up uh, another world, basically, in this game. I mean, I could go for one more hour, but I'm dragon All right, a little bit more motors. And then what do we have too much of? We have way too many copper sheets. And I need some All right. Otherwise, you need to go outside and socialize. Well, I would hate to be the cause of you having to socialize. Nice. These rows are done. This is a beast of a row. Let's get this in. making sure that this catwalk lines up with that catwalk it does we're golden that should fit perfectly snug as a bug does dang it <laughs> sounded sincere oh yeah totally I mean, we're 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 not gonna be able to finish them all tonight. We don't we don't have enough material, but 
like this is very much within reach in the next uh live stream i've ever thought about multiplayer so when i first started playing satisfactory that's all i played i played with my buddies um and my brother and my sister and my sister-in-law um and so my first save was only multiplayer multiplayer is very buggy um it can be worth it it can be fun um regardless of the fact that it can be a little 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 buggy but uh we actually have on my discord i don't run it uh, a, a member of my community uh runs a community uh playthrough so you know anybody who wants to make some new friends and come and, and hang out uh it takes a little while to figure out what the heck they're doing but yeah you know come to my discord and ask about it beams and rubber we're running low uh oh i made him uh made the error i did the error do the thing julie i did the thing How many more I can build before I run out of good stuff? Hey Pyro, uh, not much. I'm just on the last push here, trying to use up all I can. You know, and then we're, uh, you know, I'll, I'll call it a night, maybe in about. You know, one one or two more runs. I it depends on you know, how we do here. A uh, concrete and motors. That's what I. That's all I need. Here's some concrete. All the rest of the motors. Then there was some concrete I left over here. Uh, I have two coworkers and one friend of a uh, coworker that is going to play 1.0. 1, 1. So that game is full, and I got my own game to think about with a logic system in place. Based on your idea, you can get credit for that. Wait, I will be happy to take credit. Where's the break? It's right there. So I make the same mistake. I'm a kinspiration. Hold on. I need to go bomb it. That was coincidental.
Uh, you gotta send me an early access. Ooh, color cartridges. Looks good. And rods. Uh, let's load up again. Do like 15 of those. Like 15 of those. Can we handle that? Oh no, we're out of encased industrials. Uh, so let me let me pull this back until we yeah, it's almost over. It's almost over. Get in some more of these output manifolds, which I thought I finished, but clearly I did not. And then we're going to take our final picture of the evening. Uh, do we have any other breaks? No, I think this was the last one. Multiplayer can be a little frustrating for me because I like to do things the way I like to do them. And uh, I will say I got rushed a lot in my multiplayer game. Like I wanted to take time on a factory, but they wanted to progress the tech tree. You know, and so that created some friction. You know, little things, nothing crazy, just little things. As soon as we're out of parts, we're done. I think we can only build three of these. One, two, three. Yep. That's it. For now. But, I mean, we got so, so much in. I mean, these, these outside wings are done. A lot of these rows are in. Uh, I fixed this back wall. And I mean, I mean, look at this beast. This is so densely packed with material. All right, what are we gonna do for a shot? I think we have to go with something like, like this. I think we have to go with something like this. Find a, let's find a good light.
I think that looks sick. Uh, you've been on sleep watch my bad uh soon to dip out no no i appreciate it holy crap that's a factory on twitch dk pqt hey yeah no i it is a factory uh it's coming together it's coming together uh really quickly i'll show you guys the outside uh and then that's it i'm i'm out of here i've got my thumbnail picture uh i am tired i've been going for eight hours and ten minutes um, yeah, this is going to have a lot in it. We still got a long ways to go, but this is the factory unlimited repetition. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. This is the unlimited power power plant. There you go. DK PQT PQ PQD DK DK PQD. <laughs> Sorry, I'm really tired. Um, it's uh, it's five in the morning. I've been playing since nine o'clock at night. It's five in the morning. So there you go. Um, yeah, that's that's all she wrote for this evening. Next live stream is in about two and a half days. Uh, the best way to know what I'm gonna live stream next is to join my Discord and to uh, check out the schedule because it'll tell you when I live stream next based on your time zone, right? Because I have a lot of viewers all over the world and it's a pain in the ass to convert time zones. Best to just join my Discord and, and check out the scheduler. All right. I'm gonna start the save and then I'm going to say goodnight to Twitch. I have to say goodnight to Twitch first, usually. That was stream 55, you guys. Stream 55. All right. And we're saving. Okay, Twitch. Thanks for joining. Really appreciate it. And I'll see you guys in a couple of days. Come on. All right. Twitch is gone. And all right, good night, YouTube. There's the slapping song again. Gizmo, well, I'll figure it out. I'll figure out which one. All right, John, Pee Wee, Mandrigal, Pyro, Gizmo, and everybody else. I will see you guys next time.